There we go. Yeet. Hello, everyone. Hello, Mr. Obama. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Hello, howdy, howdy. Give me a second. No, okay. look, I'm Woody. Woody. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Look, I'm Woody. Howdy, 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 howdy. No, no, no. Hey, look, I am Woody. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Ha, 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 ha. Give me that. <laughs> Give me that. We can't get copyright strike. Remember that. Mm -hmm. Uh... <laughs> We're doing uh, it wrong hey, anyway. Uh, hey, look, I'm Jesus. <laughs> holy, holy, holy. <laughs> <laughs> I see you, you, can't, stuff. you can't copyright the Bible, so. <laughs> you can't copyright God. <laughs> <laughs> but can God copyright you? Technically, no. I'm. Look at me. I'm Woody. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Technically, I made a, a double pun there because he's holy, because he's Jesus. But he's holy. Don't stop no. right there. This is how we <laughs> lyrics people. This is this this is where This is how you get me to leave downhill. the campaign. <laughs> That's all it took? <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Thanks. Oh. Oh good lord. Okay. <laughs> For his intellectual property. Oh my goodness. What were you saying, JT? You cut out a bit there. I was saying, don't worry, Kit. At least I love you. <laughs> I love you too. I just like to make fun of all of you. Love you too, Kit. A booze. Like, because booze. all of you make fun of me too, so it's okay. It's a double. It's a toxic relationship that we all consent to. <laughs> we just we just gaslight each other back and forth, back and forth. It's not See, toxic if we consent to it. I mean, I mean, I. No, that's. I don't think that's how that works. <laughs> I don't think that's how that works. <laughs> Consensual ga gaslighting. Wow. That's not how that works. That's not how that works. If you're... W what? Consensual. Who hurt you? <laughs> to everybody. <laughs> my parents, my ex. Uh, that razor in third grade. Uh, oh, hold, hold up. Hold <laughs> up. And we're oh, done. No, no, Thanks for coming, no. everybody. Bye, everybody. It was nice knowing. Yeah. <laughs> I need to stop. I need to stop. <laughs> and this is how yes. I. This is this is how I get banned from Twitch. Not because of my own stuff, but because I have friends like you guys who make jokes like this. And Twitch is like, hmm. Lois, Lois, you will not get banned for making suicide jokes. Dan was literally making jokes about dildos the other day in chat. <laughs> oh yeah, no, can confirm. Can confirm. He he was literally talking about dildos. You will be fine. <laughs> Especially since you're the female species. Uh, I am- I- hang on, hang on, let me go double check. Hold up. Oh shit, Where's you're your right! Dongs? <laughs> the tits Where's are still your the man. <laughs> Can I erase them though? I don't want to be female anymore. Please. I want to go back- Femaly? I want to go back the to females. being- I want to go back to being a- to being a sperm where there was no gender. <laughs> Back, I want hey guys, to be do you know what you guys need today? What? Hold Mountain on. Dew. Hold on. Hold on. Hell yeah. <laughs> hey, <laughs> JT. The refreshing <laughs> taste of Dr. Pepper. Also, same here. <laughs> no. Oh, I forgot to draw on the map. No. Expression. Sorry, guys. I'll let you guys down. Someone said my name, but she didn't answer when I said what, so she's not going to get a response back. Get wrecked. <laughs> Are she calling my name or she talking to my brother? Which one is it? Yes. Because you why are my brother. Trying, why am I opening silence? McKinley, you are a god and we love you. This is Calamus. What did I walk into? You didn't walk into anything. Hell. You certainly didn't make walk into me making suicide jokes. Nothing. And dildos. And dildos. Lots of dildos. Always dildos. No, that was Dan. That was not me. <laughs> Uh-huh. That was Bread Hero Dan. We're associated with him. He is he is the one that talks about the dildos. <laughs> he is the one who talks about the he is the one that talks about the penors. Penors. The wee wee peepees. The wee wee peepees. The, wee -wee -pee -pee. the dung dong. Wee wee. Wee wee. <laughs> <laughs> Question. <laughs> hmm. Question. What 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 a French I call this cool stick? A croissant or a baguette? Hmm. 
because it, it does bend down. Uh, but it's also I want to kill myself. They call this episode just to be called penis jokes. <laughs> okay, we should like sort of do the recap before we start Who's... losing our mind. Okay, chat. So last session, they had just finished fighting the orc camp. Um, the chief is dead. Colvar is dead. All of the orcs are dead except for one who escaped because JT's polearm was just not long enough. Um, they had a bit of a a little bit of a, not about so length, it's about how I travel. use it. Don't talk about my pull arms that way. <laughs> I JT, it's okay. And then they had a little bit of trouble, roughly a day, and then they walked in, walked up upon a what appears to be a centaur. They are unsure if it is hostile at the moment or not. However, they are attempting to sneak up on it for some reason. And depending on how roll they uh, well they roll, interesting things will happen. Okay, you say for some reason, but it's very obviously evil and should generally be killed. <coughs> Either evil or possessed. You you describe his eyes in great detail. Must be fair. Well, maybe it's just hay fever. <laughs> Well, then let's give it a mercy kill and be done with it. <laughs> what happened? Nothing. Give them a she could slate peach. No! They'll be overpowered then. Let's have a They don't deserve a she could slate. They're not Link. But what if we want to? Yeah, sadly, Darius is not too much of a twink. Excuse me? Excuse me? <laughs> I'm eating a cookie and I'm nearly choking because of yourself. Yes. Excuse me? I know I'm going to die, wanna so I might as well eat today. You want to say that again? Do Is you that want a threat to... or an offer? Do you want to repeat yourself there? We're not getting a Shinka slate because Darius is not a fucking twink. Hang on a second. <laughs> Hang on. Hold on. Well, is that going to be the same as Twink Darius. Oh god. He is Twonk. Stop it, please. Oh shit. I, I fucked up. <laughs> it's worth it. There you go. That's how much death damage you take. No, okay. That's all the death damage. Let me just use my final death. Last okay. death save. Is everyone... Lois, can chat hear the, the suspenseful music? Uh, it's muted right now just because Rhythmbot is being a bit of an ass right now. Oh, okay. Rhythm well, Ball chat, is... you can't hear it, but there's some really suspenseful music going on to set the mood. Just because DMCA is also a bitch as well, I don't want to risk it right now. Okay, um, I know the other one that I chose for tonight is not copyright available. It's, so that one should be fine. Yeah, even then, just rhythm has just really been loud for me at the moment. Like, rhythm's just had, like, a fucking boost beam. It's just boost based on my ear, my ears. Like, even at 1%, I'm just like, this is just, it's just like 100%. I can barely hear anything, even oh, at okay. 1% volume. So, for, for, my own, for my own sanity. <laughs> Please. Okay. JT, I have a question. Yeah? How did you do the health bar thing above the tokens? How does that go? How gotta click on the that? token. You gotta go to that gear that appears. Okay, click. Uh, right there, you should somewhere. You um, I doubt this thing has a character sheet, so there should be like two options: one on the left, one on the right. You want the one on the left. You should see something called token bars. Token bar options. Yeah, you should see like a a green one, a blue one, and a a red one. That just put in the values you want. You know what? It's fine. This is fine. It's fine. There you go. None of you can see it. I can't see it. But I know it's there. I'm going to move him down a little bit so I can't see it though. Alright. Well. Is everyone ready? No. No. <laughs> My ass is not ready, but I'm also ready at the same time. I don't want to die. That's what she said. I don't want to die.
I don't want to die. I mean, you should die, depending on what you guys do. So let's continue. Woo! So right now, chat, where we are, Darius is hiding behind um, a five-foot little cliff spot. Hoot is hiding behind a rock. Alina is hiding behind a rock. And Bowie is being smart, has a little bit of distance, and is hiding in the a bushy tree area while Kit... Or Brooke is I'm a cat. out in the open, is out in the open, but in the form of a house cat. So, who wants to go first? No one. Rolling. No. How, you? how okay. much is he paying attention to? Do me I right have now? to choose? How much is he paying attention to me right now? Um. You keep getting side glances from it. Like it knows you're there. It's watching you. It doesn't seem happy that you're there, but it looks like it could care less that you are there. Okay, I'm gonna because last time I said this, um, I'm gonna finish up grooming myself, and I'm going to walk away. Okay. Going around and can I? I can see some the others, or they head to me as well. Rolling perception. Fifteen. Fifteen. Um, you can see Hoot. Just because you can barely see like one of one or two of his feathers sticking out from behind the rock, you can't see in any of the others. Okay. I'm going to walk kind of in that direction and then go right past him. Or then, even though I don't know she's here, I'm going to go hide behind um, the rock that Lena's behind me. And then be like, oh, hey, I didn't know you were here. Okay. So since you guys are not in combat, you can you don't have to worry about your movement speed. Um, so as Yeah, so you can move freely right now. Um, combat is not in session, so you, can just, you don't have to worry about your movement speed. All right. All right. I'm looking up her and being like, oh my god, oh no. Lisa <laughs> just looked out at the little cat and before I just, before I just start, I just gotta just go, oh, that's Brooke. Kind of realizing probably there's something just obviously like, oh, that's Brooke. She's just gonna just gently kind of like, I guess, grab Brooke like, under the arm and just kind of drag her behind the rock, just like, stay. Yeah, Brooke's gonna stay right behind the rock with her. God damn it, Kyle. Oh, hey, look, now 20. No! <laughs> Just what? so we have a fresh little thing going, everyone roll stealth again. Boo is just stationary. Does she have to? <laughs> um, because of where Booey is, I'm not going to have you do it because you're hiding behind a bush, um, and also in front of you, you're, he's up on an incline, but there's still a rock in between you and him, as well as the bush and some trees, so you're fine. Everyone else, though, does need to. Right, doesn't really matter for me, because he knows I'm existent. <laughs> eh, whatever. I'm going to go in real perception, give me a second. I acquired a 13. You know, I need to stop using this dice set. I really do. <laughs> because I feel like I feel like every time no, every time it. I use the dice set that Espion gave me, you all get fucked. So you know what? We're going to ignore that 20 again, and we're going to use McKinley's dice. Bruh. Bruh. Let's see if McKinley's dice goes any better or worse. Better for us, worse for Peach, please. <laughs> all right. Um, all of you are good except for Brooke. He actually now see you step on a branch as Alina is dragging you a bit. And yes, I just meant what. So Lenny ain't coming back to the college. Hold on. Hey, you guys, you guys, you guys think Winnie's not going back to the college? (laughs) 
And now for today's sponsor, Dr. Pepper, for once it's not Mountain Dew. Because me and uh, Jess are both drinking it. Heresy. Suck a JT. Majority yeah. wins. <laughs> Majority overrules. No, quality wins. Mountain Dew will always be on top. Mm -mm. Mm. Exactly. I'd rather not drink something that looks like it is battery acid. <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather not drink something that looks like diarrhea water. What did I talk about? No. That's not cocoa. <laughs> or should I say caca? <laughs> did I? Did I? <laughs> I come back. I come back. And the first thing I hear is it looks like battery acid. <laughs> I'm not going to question it. I'm going to pretend I didn't hear anything. Um, Let's move on. Kit, Alina, you kind of curse quietly to yourself. Um, Me uh, You drag. You, huh? Was that, say, Alina curses or like. Well. Her version, like dang it or something. Heck. Um, <laughs> you tr yeah, you drag the cat Brooke behind the rock. As you do, she um makes a bit of sound in some crusty leaves that are on the ground. Makes a bit of a sound, loud sound, and you watch as the centaur turns and looks dead at Brooke. Fuck. Okay. And now you can get a more clear look at just how Imposing. weird the centaur's face looks. Like, he's feline, but... It's a lionel. He has, he has feline features, but he's also... He looks like a normal person, like a normal human face, but he has feline features as well. And then what makes it even weirder to you is just his blood red eyes. It's very unsettling to look at. I kind of give up uh, when he sees me. Um, I give a question and kind of give me a second. Wow. Kind of all sound. <laughs> hey Darius, I need you to roll stealth for me again and for hoot. Oh, <gasps> please, dice. I have acquired a nineteen. Nice. Just nice. Jessica, I need you to roll. Oh, 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 oh my god! That is a 28. Um. <sighs> Fuck. <laughs> Hoot, you're fine. Hoot, hoot. You realize that before, perhaps maybe the cat version of Brooke was able to see your feathers, and so as you see him turn and begin walking in your direction you're able to flatten your feathers out a bit more and squish yourself closer to the rock to, able to get far enough behind it so you're not noticed Darius you don't get quite as lucky you don't know if maybe it was your hat um, or maybe like Maybe you moved a pebble at the wrong moment and he heard the slight sound. But he does notice you. Oh. <laughs> I need you to roll initiative. God damn it. Oh no. There goes our plan. Just Darius. He hasn't noticed the rest of you. Okay. Would we also, notice that change. he noticed Darius? Oh yeah, 13. you would know. He give me just a second. I have to change the the a thing. Do it. You got a 13. Sorry, give me a second. Should have run my dude with plus two to initiative. Peach, may I ask, can I join the initiative? Why? I have a very stupid idea. 
I will let you, but he still thinks you're a cat, so I'm not going to count it as him being aggroed on you. Yeah, I'm going right. to... Give me a sec. I'm trying to figure out something. I used to know how to do this, but then I got stupid. That's a mood. JT, how do you do the initiative counter on this damn thing? Are you fucking kidding me? There should be an option, though, on the, like, the, <laughs> the task left. It's like um, a clock or something. It's, it's near the bottom. You'll see it. Aha! Like that. Thank you. Hold on. It won't go away. Aha, thank you. I figured it out. Ooh. What did you get, Darius? A 13? Yeah, 13. And then the cat got, oh, not one. Making it a three. It's technically a three. It's technically a three. That's honestly just me just like, it's Here, you get my curse. Take it. I don't want it. <laughs> I already told you the dice gods the, hate me. The, the curse thought with Amaretto, and now it's just spreading to everyone else. <laughs> no, I've, I've just been absorbing it. I've been absorbing it. <laughs> <laughs> Man, this... Lois, if you want to find a better boss, boss or not boss, but battle music, go ahead because this sucks. Oh, I thought God. I found a good one, but apparently I didn't. Oh, give me, give me like a quick idea, like the theme of the fly, and I'll probably find something. Yeah. What'd you say? Give me a quick, a quick idea what the, what the theme of the fight is like, and I'll probably find something. Uh, mini boss. Mini boss. I guess. Um, I got this one. Give me a second. Alright, JT, don't tell me. Your AC is a 17. Nice one, yeah. Huh? Yeah, you're right. Hey! I did it. There you go, Peach. <gasps> oh, no. What is that? Oh, no! McKinley, no! What have you done? What the fuck has she done? You have McKinley to you have a McKinley to blame for this. Oh, what she? Oh no! Did she do what the I dice requested? McKinley gave me are loaded. Oh, oh no! Just the like dice the ones McKinley that Espeon gave, gave you were loaded too. Yeah. Uh huh. But in a different way. Okay. I feel like maybe you should use the bot like everybody else. Melissa's server, so none of us. Why don't you? Why don't you use the bot when you got actual dice? <laughs> Peach died. We bullied her. No. We bullied her too hard. <gasps> she took too much abuse from us. We love you, Peach. She finally knows my pain. And now for our sponsor, Doctor Pepper again, or fresh water. Now for our sponsor, water. <laughs> it's like a real sponsor for the viewers. Thank you for being here. Hell yeah. I don't know how you guys tolerate us every week, week after week, but apparently you do. What? I don't know how you tolerate me. I'm charming, dazzling personality, and amazing charisma, but yeah, I can see the worst in it. <laughs> wow! I thought you loved me. Harsh, JT. Harsh, but fair, honestly. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Rhythm decides to die. Take him out. Take him out, boys. Rhythm needs to knock it off. Oof. Okay. I think this is more appropriate. There we go. Got it. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. Ooh. 
why do I don't use the bot, you ask? Because I want to use my shiny click clacks. Shiny click clacks go roll. <laughs> Goes roll. So is he targeting me with a ranged attack? Yeah, he's, uh... Are you prone? Well, I have... I believe I have total cover, considering I'm behind a five-foot barrier, meaning I can't be targeted. Yeah, you're right. I need to do... I need to do... disadvantage. No, if you're behind total cover, you can't be targeted at all. Oh. If you were to move adjacent to me, however, he'd have advantage, because I am prone. But he'd have to use a melee attack. Hold on. Yeah, there's three, three types of cover in D&D. Well, technically four. No cover, half cover, three, three quarters cover, and total cover. Oh, oh well. Oh, well. Why do people ping me when I play D&D? I don't know. Why must two people talk to me while I'm busy? I felt that. Me. Has my, has my icon is streaming. <laughs> Everyone. Lois, look at I'm busy. <laughs> I mean, move them far down. There. That's better. Alright, JT. Your turn. Well, see the he cover. has a longbow drawn. Uh, I'm gonna... Oh, he has a longbow. Oh, in that case, I'm not getting up. <laughs> Stay away from me, you freak, Major. Hey, uh, I find that offensive. <laughs> <laughs> that it, hurt my throat. Well, you're going to know it. Because you're not being wielded by a freakish cat centaur. How dare you? That's, that's insulting to Bowie. <laughs> Well, she's not no, a I, centaur, is she? But she's a cat. I take no offense. All cats are <laughs> bastards. <laughs> All dwarves are bastards in their father's eyes. Oof. Oh, well, I'm going to do the best thing I can. And I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to get up, so I'm not technically prone. I'm still going to crouch behind the... I'm going to grab as much cover as I can from that outcropping there. Though I'm pretty sure it's not going to be total cover, considering he moved there to try and hit me. Yeah. And I'm going to get my, my partisan out. Come at me, nerd. <laughs> try it. Try it. I dare you. Joke's on you. He's 25 feet away. Joke's on you. I have sentinel. When he comes close, I'm going to make your life yeah, hell. Yeah, I am very much aware. Is that the end of your turn? That's the end of my right. turn. Kitty cat, your turn. Hell yeah. If you catch me in an AoE attack, I will peel your skin from head to toe. <laughs> I, will wear, I will wear your fur as my new hat. Um, you got that one. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Might have to. Okay, I'm gonna. See here. Didn't entirely think this through, but what you doing? What am I doing? Uh... That's the question I have to What are you doing? I don't know. I just started life, and now here I am. You know, uh... everyone was really quiet for a while. And I couldn't figure out why. I had you all on max volume, and then I the laptop was turned down. <laughs> oh my goodness. I couldn't figure out why the fuck I couldn't hear Jessica. And then I realized, oh, your laptop was turned down. God, this is gonna be stupid. What are you I'm doing? Also muted. Okay. I'm gonna You can't use spells in animal form, by the way. You're right, I can't use spells and so that's why I'm trying to think about this carefully. Um I'm going over he to does the I still think that you're a cat. I'm gonna run over to this rock. Would he be able to see me this from like if I go like he'll see me running to it, but would he see me behind it? What rock? 
this rock. Uh, give me a second. Do you have enough movement speed to get there? Cats have 40 movement speed. Um, give me, give me a second. Uh, I'll let it. It's technically 41, but I'll I'll let you do it. Okay. All right, well, so no, actually, no. It's right here. Do you see where I'm pinging? Well, God fucking damn it. Hold on. You're pinging on the wrong way. Right, right here is 40. Right there. Okay. I'm trying to do this without revealing myself, but... He would see you run. You're in his field of vision. He would see me run, but I'm cat. trying to... He sees you as a cat, so he doesn't really care. Okay, I'm just gonna... I don't want to run that. I'm gonna actually run more in this direction, like, right over here-ish. Okay. As a cat. Go ahead and move your, Go ahead and move your token. Mm-hmm. Hang on, I make a hi I, I hiss at him. I hiss at him. That's my action. Okay. Uh, what the fuck, girl twenty? What are you doing? God damn it! Can God fucking damn it! Don't you love internet? That's bullshit. No, as a matter of fact, I don't. Mm, it's the best, totally, huh? <clears throat> it's not just let us play D and D. That's only one in life. Okay. 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 You need to move. Hey, JT, I need you to do me a favor. Yeah? I need you to make me a deck save. I'm not sure I care much for actually doing But out of respect for you as a person, I think I will. <laughs> uh, what sort of cup? I, I have. I'm not entirely sure how high this um, stop cropping it behind is. Um, please, what was your question? Would I have cover being behind this um, outcropping? And if so, what? Not complete cover, no. You would still be affected by... So half, you would... half cover or three quarters cover? Um... It's only five feet. Um, this got fucking damn. It. Hold on, right here is only five. So you you're still you're covered, but not completely. You'd still be affected by what he's about to do. Well, I mean, it gives me a bonus being covered, so I want to determine exactly how much cover I'm behind. How tall are you? I'm like, how would I know? I think I'm like six four. Um. It'd be three quarters cover then. Like I'm like I'm like. It would be. It would feet. be. Are we talking about in? Are we talking about in character? Yes, JT. Oh, six one. It would be. What would you say, Burb? That it would be like three fourths. You said. Yeah, three fourths because. Yeah, it would be because the wall is five. Sorry. Yeah. You're fine. Twenty-nine. You pass. You. He doesn't seem very happy that the cat is hissing at him, but at the same time he's ignoring it because it's a cat, and he's more focused on you, the immediate threat. And you can see that he doesn't. He can tell that he can't get you with his bow, and so you see him put it away. And then he opens his mouth, and you think maybe he's going to yell at you or roar or something. And then you see smoke begin to fall from his mouth. And in the split second, you're able to duck down and cover yourself before flames come out in a cone. And just, if you had not been, 
if you had not crouched down in time, you would have been burned. Man. Oh, God fucking damn it. Really? Really, D&D? &D? Or not D&D, &D, but roll 20. You've got to do that. Like that. <laughs> yeah. You see him just a stream of fire comes out, comes billowing out. And you're very thankful for your quick reflexes that you earned your earned in your time in the military because if you had not ducked, you would have been burned. But that's all he can do. And it's now your turn. Wait. I'm gonna call on the others. I can't do a voice right now. Forgive me. I failed the... Uh, he's weak to fours. Last him. Black him. Oh boy. Uh, vacation shot. So, so should... He should mm -hmm. go in their thing? Yeah, maybe. Okay, so... I'm Boo's still on the initiative. Yeah. Boo's gonna count... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boo's gonna count down, and the moment she reaches zero, she's gonna move over here. Yep. The, over here, on. she's. Hold on, guys, sorry. wait, hold on. Oops. Why are you saying wait? Because I'm still on the initiative. Yeah. So, like, should they roll initiative as well? That's why I'm saying wait for. Oh, no, yeah. we're, not, we're not in initiative yet. This counts as a. A Basically, okay. a surprise action of sorts. All mm -hmm. right. So this is basically before we enter initiative, because we haven't been discovered yet and such. So mm -hmm. the moment she counts down to zero with Alina, Boo's gonna go out here in somewhat plain view. Let's see how far this. Is. Yeah. Ooh. No, but right now you're in his field of vision. He can yep. see you. Gonna throw a javelin. I'm not sure if that add advantage because we're surprised attacking, but and, well. Well, so what's what's the range of the javelin? Let me check. Actually, it's not that far. Actually, it's thirty two. It's thirty two or one hundred twenty. Okay, so it would be um, in disadvantage because it's out of its uh, normal range. Yeah, he's sixty five feet from you. But what? It, wouldn't this be at advantage because we haven't entered initiative yet? Um, no, because it's, That's it's, not it's, how that it's, works. it's the weapon's range. So the black part of the weapon's range, or a ranged weapon, that's what you can throw without disadvantage. And then the anything in the in the lighter gray, it hurts the fact that it's pretty much, you're throwing it further than you should. It's pretty much, you're putting a lot of effort to get it further than then it can technically go. Okay. Let's see. Might as well use my full movement speed then. 30, okay. And then just measure again. Okay, still over, still over the limit. So yeah, disadvantage with Javelin. Mm -hmm. Let me see here. Dice rolls, not controversial. Burr, please. God fucking damn it. I keep thinking that this is the regular server. Screw, <laughs> screw you and your prefixes, okay? <laughs> 15 to hit. That's a miss. Okay, so the javelin, javelin miss, but bonus action casting Shield of Faith on Darius. Additional 2 AC for a minute. So his AC is now 19. Yep. Actually, 10 minutes, or until concentration breaks. Ooh. I'm going to take my... Uh... Bowie roll initiative. Alrighty. And the second Bowie misses, uh, I'll take my just two attacks. I don't think I... I don't... I don't know if JT can confirm not. I don't think I get advantage for surprise. Is it advantage for surprise? Because I'm in range. Internet, please. God damn it. 
resend. Uh, okay, well, I'll just fucking use phone. Cut. Let me just double check. Do I get? Let me just double check. Um, not surprised the condition. Give me a second. Well, surprise, I don't think it's an actual condition in this. Mm -hmm. I get confused in, like so many different rulings. I don't think I've ever been like um, in a campaign where like, someone does surprise the same way as someone Lois, else, to be frank. Before yeah. you roll to attack, I was I'm gonna say, um, this will be my ruling for now. Um, your first attack will be an advantage because he didn't know you were there. The second one will just be normal. Okay. That's I'll, I'll, I'll double. Check. I'll find that thing, but for now that seems okay. I'll but I'll, I'll I'll check around because there's so many weird shit. Verb. Twenty two. Good job. Two D twenty. Keep highest one plus thirteen. What did you get for initiative, Verb? Twenty two. I did the wrong yep. prefix. You didn't see anything. I did the wrong prefix, but you didn't see anything. Oof. Look, it's confusing, man. Oh no, I can't see anything because I'm I'm stuck on a, a constant connecting screen. What? Well, that sucks. Okay, so that's a 29 and a dirty 20. Both hit. Okay, and the first shot, I'm going to use a grasping arrow to reduce his movement speed by 10 foot and also do a lot of, some poison damage because... By 10 feet? Yes, because... Uh, yeah, so, give me a second. Let me roll the damage, so that's... Uh... Okay, what's my damage again? So it's two attacks of 2d... I only did 4d8 because I thought... Oh, did I action search? No, it's just 2d8 plus... Uh, 16 plus... Actually, is it 16? Yeah. Uh, plus 4d6. God damn it, wrong. <laughs> <laughs> again! I swear. Got through all that pro all that progress, and then did the wrong prefix again. Leave me alone. Uh, Thirty eight damage. Um. So the thirty eight. Yes. And then any resistances? So that's uh, nine. Um. Twenty five of that. Give 20... me a second. <laughs> okay. Get. Okay. Your old twenties acting up again. Always. When doesn't it? When I'm not yay. here. That is true. Don't yay, because if I can't do it, then no one's doing it. I'm <laughs> being sarcastic. <laughs> we can all cry together. It's okay. Ooh. Okay, Lois, what were you saying? Uh, 25 points of that is piercing. And then, uh, just in case there's resistance or anything like that, 9, 10, <laughs> cool. 13 of that is poison. And now he now his feet is reduced by 10 foot, so... He's like now kind of got some brambles and shit like that, and lovely little thorns around him. And if he, if he moves, he takes uh, roll maybe... twenty. I swear to fucking god, <laughs> roll twenty, please, please work with us for this one time. I swear to god, roll twenty. <laughs> roll twenty, please. You have one job. Oh my fucking god, I'm going to. Don't kill anything yet. Save, save that for later. <laughs> oh my fucking god Peach. I'm going to kill myself Peach. I'm going to kill myself I'm going to kill myself No, Peach. I'm going to kill myself Peach you were cutting no. it out when oh you when, when you were going mm, you were cutting it out it sounded like a fucking lord mode for a second because <laughs> <laughs> you were cutting out it sounded like a lord mode <laughs> here Lois this is grasping arrow do you see it was it visible? Uh, I think I see. God it. fucking damn it! Roll twenty. It's okay. No. I'll remember he's he's, he's growing. I'll remember he's grasped as long as long as he doesn't send his action to do anything. I'll remember. Does it? Is it not showing where the I, fucking I, thing is? Love drawing. Can I draw brambles on him? <laughs> Which is not a question because I'm doing it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> JT, please stop being a chaotic being. Lowest roll initiative. Oh my god. Yeah, we'll do. We'll finish it with plus five. <laughs> Ow, crap. Ow, crap. <laughs> oh my god. But, okay, um, sweet. Yeah, if, if he moves more than one foot, uh, he will take 46 slashing damage. Also, I rolled a 23 for initiative. 
God damn, I rolled 20! Okay. Mm, so it's my turn? Give me a minute before I kill right. myself. Don't That's kill yourself, I please. Even love turn you. Oh my fucking god! What's it doing? It's being a bitch! Maybe refresh to see if that fixes it. I've refreshed so many times. Well, there goes my idea. Any background tabs or other? No, things? just the ones I fucking need for this encounter. It's not Lena's turn. It's not Bowie's turn. It's not her turn. It's Darius's turn. No. Well, yes, it, it, he's not taking his turn. Yeah, all I did was say we hit them. All I did was say oh, was okay. I thought that was his turn. I thought he said that was his turn. No, all he no. did was crush down when he got fire spewed at him. Okay, sorry, I didn't know that. Sorry. No, you're good. You didn't know. You're not good, and you should be ashamed. <laughs> wow! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus! Wait a second. Fucking hell. Did I cast? I, did I cast hundreds mark on them? I don't know. You cast. I, have, you, well, I remember you cast Slayer's Prey and uh, Hunter Sense. You cast something on them. My my I, yeah my spell slot I bet it's not for people awareness, maybe. No no because you know it must. I know I use something on them. You know it must because I know you use Hunter Sense and uh, Slayer's Prey. I think it might have been. Check your DMs because I know if you used one of them, I know Peach sent you the weaknesses because she didn't want to say it out loud. Hunter Sense is different. Mm -hmm. Well, that's because I used Hunter. Sense. Prey and hunters marker. I know you used the thing. I know you used the thing, the thing, thing last time to see if there was any fiends or celestials or things around. But that was like when we had like a. But wasn't that before a long rest? Yeah. Everybody would have gotten the slot back. No, because you used it again when we when you guys found the centaur. Oh yeah. Yeah, did. I think, I think yeah, we right. did in order to find out if that was the aberration. That was it. Yeah. But I do know that I did. I'm pretty sure I put Slayer's Prey on him too. You did because you because you, you did Hunter Sense and Slayer's I Prey. Remember. I remember that. Yeah, I, do you... remember, I do remember that. You did do both of those. You did both your uh, monster Slayer abilities. I remember things. Roll twenty. Can you That's stop being a piece of shit, please, for five fucking minutes? That's all I ask. <laughs> Fluff just said, oh god, I thought Lois said she did 46 slashing, not 4d6 slashing. <laughs> Alright, JT. What is the turn that you are taking? You and your oh, I'm, about to be little, I'm about to be like the worst person. But I'm going to... <laughs> that was good. I like that one. <laughs> New <laughs> <laughs> wow. I'm going to think to lower levels of subhuman depravity. Subhuman. I should listen to that next. Uh, I'm going to hop this little this little uh -huh. al alcove here. Uh huh. I'm going to step five feet closer to that thing. I'm approximately uh -huh. 18 feet away, so I, that should put me in range. Uh huh. I'm going to stab him with my uh -huh. action. I oh, forgot. Darn it, I forgot to frick. I guess I'll uh, hit him twice and then bonus action attack if I have the hunter's mark before. You forgot range, to pull on your pole arm. I forgot to make it a mega pole arm. <laughs> That's that sounds like that could be something else entirely. So go ahead and move your token and then roll. I mean all you have to do is just rub it a bit to make it longer. <laughs> We've got time, we're in combat, man. Oh yeah, true. Fuck. <laughs> I need gotta, like, like time me. and leave me alone. Oof. So you have to go up on some people would call stamina. <laughs> I fucking uh, hey, hey, don't don't insult me. <laughs> Wait, GT, I, roll uh, the hit first. Yeah, I did. Oh. That's my uh, hit. I know my damage is. Uh, I know that forty four is appropriate for damage, but no, that's that's the hit. <laughs> Uh, I got a that would be a twenty-two, a twenty-six, and a twelve. Twelve misses. Everything else hits. So we know the armor class is probably fifteen. Oh, ow! 
Ow. No. Ow. <laughs> that hurts to look at. That makes me happy. Of course it makes no. you happy. Oh. happy you feel, feel for the That means you didn't pray hard enough for the dice gods. And now you're now you're getting punished. JT pray harder. Get me. Punished with you. <laughs> because now, since I only moved like fifteen feet, including my jump, so I'm just gonna go back behind the outgrove. Okay. Hey McKinley, I know you're in chat. I just want you to know that Every time I've rolled with your dice so far, I've gotten a 20. So thank you. We are back on here with slide. Also, JT, when Same. you move away like that, does that give him opportunity to attack on you? I'm not in his attack range. Unless he has an attack range of 10 feet. No, when you were up there with him, because you were right there with him, weren't you? That's map distortion. I was 10 feet away. I got reach. I'm going to use it. Oh, okay. Who? It's the cat's turn. Yay. Which one? Me. The non-normal cat. Okay. Um, the non-therapist. <laughs> the why not? Um, I bonus action unwild shape. Okay. And I yell at him and I say Freeze! And I cast Frostbite. What do I have to do with that? Con save, 16 or higher. Okay. Okay, so if he fails, what does he do? Um, on a failed save, the target takes 1d6 cold damage, and it has disadvantage on the next weapon attack roll it makes before the end of its next turn. Roll 20, I swear to fucking god! Uh, so oh did god. it fail? I need you to hold on for a second before okay. I go lose my mind. Alrighty. You know what? Fuck you, roll 20. I'll just stay fucking zoomed out the entire goddamn time. Because apparently I can't zoom in and have you fucking work like you're supposed to. Yikes. Oh my god. If I cannot do this, I'm going to lose my goddamn mind. It's 2d6 now, because I'm... I swear, it's always something. It's always something with this. I'm going to exit out of the... Okay, cat, or not cat, kit. Yep. If he fails the save, what happens? Um, because in fifth level druid, actually, he takes 2d6 damage and has disadvantage on the next weapon attack roll it makes. Any for... weapon, or is it just, is it melee based, or? Just weapon attack. Roll 20, what the? God damn! If I may ask, did he fail? Yes, Kit. Okay. Please don't be shit damage. You know what? That's not shit damage. I get to stay zoomed out the entire fucking time because when I zoom in at all, the fucking screen freaks out and it just doesn't want to work. So I get to stay like this the entire goddamn time. Thanks, Roll20, for doing your goddamn job. Pr really appreciate it. Alright. Do you do anything like with your hands when you say freeze or do um, you just unwall shape and say freeze? What are you doing? 
I, as I unwild shape, I, I point at him and a bit of frost seems to gather on my finger and then it dissipates and gathers on him. Okay, thank you. Also, yeah, chat, I'm not in a bad mood. I'm actually in a very good mood. However, I live in banjo country. Um, so my internet is very shit. So when you hear me bitching at roll 20, it's because it's freaking the fuck out because I have a very nice um laptop but the internet does not like me or my laptop so it makes everything i'm trying to run run like molasses and it's horrible <laughs> so i'm not in a bitchy mood i'm actually very happy right now so if i sound bitchy i apologize can i just say i love that you had the sentence live in banjo country and runs like molasses <laughs> in the same sentence <laughs> leave me alone I don't want to we be love called you, out Peach. like this. Do you though? Sometimes I wonder. I mean, most of the time. Oh no. <laughs> okay. No. All right. So he seems a bit off, caught off guard a bit when he when you suddenly appear, um, as he knew that you were a cat element before. You feel free to him. Um, and you feel tingling on your fingertips as frost gathers there. And then a moment later, it melts away, leaving your hands slightly damp, like you just washed your hands and didn't dry them. And then you see them, you see more frost suddenly appear on his skin. And you can tell that he, he notices the frost. However, if it hurts him, he doesn't show it. And if it bothers him from being cold or stopping his movement from being too fluid... Again, you can't tell. I smirk because that's not what I was trying to do with the spell. It worked in my favor. Is that the end of the end of your turn? Um, I am going to move, uh, uh, no, like, yeah, just move back, like, five feet right there. Okay. It is Alina's turn. Oh, shit. Hello. Uh, did you guys get this far? Um, okay, give me a second. I need to I got so many, I got, I got like- 20, god fucking damn it. Like, I, I don't remember which like tab is in which, because like, for context, for people who don't know, because like, cause, like uh, the way I stream, I have to things open on like, not, not just like a different tab, but in an entirely separate like, window. So I'm just like, which window? Which window has this one on again? Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> um, let's see. Well, what can I do? What- well, what can I do? I mean, I'm playing a fighter, so like it's less of what 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 can't I do, and more just less what am I gonna do the same time again? Um, don't want to use my action surge just yet, just in case if I need that. Um, still have Drew Craft, but that's not gonna be useful right now. Hmm. Stomach, please shut up. I know you're hungry, but shut up. No one asked your opinion. Okay, probably just, yeah, I'm honestly, not gonna waste a banishing arrow just yet, or another, doing another grasping arrow just yet. So, um, pew pew. <laughs> I, I just, I just, just say pew pew. That's just, that's just my, that's just my, my calling for just attack twice. It's just pew pew now. Okay, go ahead and roll. Uh, that is a dirty 20 and a 19. Both hit. Duty eight plus sixteen. That is three damage. All right. You've shot him already twice before, right? Yes. All right. You fire off two arrows at him, and you can. He already has. He already has two. Um, in him, one in his. Um, like, I guess you could call it the shoulder of the. One of his front legs. I don't know what you, the hell you would call it. Knees that are um, he, you, you do hit him pretty damn hard with these two shots. And you can tell that's pissing him off. Because he, he turns his gaze and looks directly at you. Hmm. Do I, uh, I don't have any good lines. So I'll just like I'll just literally just kind of just like stare at stare him, just like you know, narrow her eyes and just kind of just uh, ready another shot. Just like, just obviously, just you know, let me worry about that. I've got more arrows coming. 
Do you look him in the eye? Yes. Roll me wisdom safe. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> I got good wisdom. That's a 21. Nothing happens. Heh. Heh. Is that gonna be the end of your turn? Yes. <laughs> Bowie, it's your turn. Oh boy, let's do this shit. So, Javelin's missing. This guy seems like, you know, pretty, pretty big threat up close, so. Hmm. Bonus action spiritual weapon, so I can get 60 foot range. And let's see how far I am from this guy. Bonk. That's where your javelin is, by the way, that little line. Alrighty. Oh, okay, I can, I can just hit the guy with spiritual weapon from here, okay. So I'm just gonna roll to attack. What's my spiritual weapon thing again? Plus six. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Look at me. I am the captain now. Does a 25 hit? Yep. Alrighty. A D8 plus three. God damn it. Everyone's rolling all ones for damage Aww. except for Alina. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Excuse me, I did not roll one for damage. Frostbite is just shit. Anyway. But anyways. You you guys would basically see Bowie like it looks like he she's holding a spear, but she isn't. And then all of a sudden a blue a blue like phantom partisan just appears next to the freaking centaur guy and then just starts slashing. Because I didn't realize that spiritual weapon can actually do that. Hey. <laughs> and that's the end of my turn. Uh, does spiritual weapon have its own initiative or no? No. No? Okay. It, it's basically just a ranged melee. <laughs> oh, a ranged okay. magical melee. And it can be whatever you want. Hey, what's yep. Kit's... Uh, hey, Kit, what's Brooks AC? Uh, that is 21. 21. Lois, what is the effect of your brambles? Uh, his speed is removed, his speed is reduced by 10 foot, and if he moves more uh -huh. than one foot, so even, even, even if he takes like a step forward, he takes 46 slashing damage. For each foot moved? No, just every time once he moves, every, once every turn he moves, uh, okay. he takes 46 slashing. Kit, what's your AC? 21. How is it 21? Because uh, monk plus shield plus um, cloak of protection. Monks have ridiculous AC. Yeah, it skyrocketed the second I went monk. Um, Kit, we read unarmed with defense again. I'm sorry to do this in the middle of a session, but we read it again. Hold on. Okay, uh, that means Bowie's AC is also lower as well. So sorry. It is. Wait, what? But it says my AC is that. Feed again. Oh, what the hell, D and D Beyond? That is weird. It says I have the unarmored bonus though. Yeah, I know it's weird. So what is my AC? You have a shield equipped on you. Nineteen. Nineteen. Do you want to get rid of your shield? Which I imagine you would, considering it's the lesser bonus. I mean, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of the shield eventually, but. Or hold on, let me so just. So your check AC it. is nineteen. Yeah, I guess so. We're not using an armor bonus right now. Yeah, I'm sorry. Eight. One, two, three. Is a twenty-four hit? Yeah. Okay. Give me a second. Nine. 
Mm. I just can't keep on have it as that the unarmored bonus is still there though. No but, clue. Because it's, it's the programming, it it can't like it's it's just it's just it's you know it's code. It can't do as much as like in person, I guess. Yeah. You are going to take eighteen points of piercing damage. All right. Give me a second. One D D Beyond decides to fix their fucking shit. I'm zoomed all the way out, and it's still going to be a bitch. Oh my god. Hit it. D&D Beyond, I swear to god. This I am D&D Beyond. I don't know why I keep saying that. It's fucking roll 20. What's the difference? <laughs> uh, actually, without the shield, my it's 18, but it doesn't matter because it hit me anyway. So let's just assume I don't have the shield, considering I didn't know about the unarmored. Oh my god, so. roll 20. What you doing there, Burb? I'm planning my next move. I just want to turn the fucking centaur roll 20. Can you please let me do that? Please! Alright. He... One day, Roll20 will actually be a little, not so something, a little bitch. One day. Okay. Well, you see him pull out his spear, and he looks dead at you, um, not happy at all that you, um, put some frost on him. <laughs> and he paws at the his one of his front legs that you can see has arrows sticking out of it um it paws at the front ground with one of his hooves and then it charges at you um with it he has a spear out and he gets you nice right in the shoulder and then at the same time you're because he's going so fast it just goes a little bit just a little bit deeper causing you just a bit more pain and then he's going to continue um, off to the side. And Alina, he is now staring, like, dead at you. Beautiful. Also, he moved, so uh, let me just... Yeah. I know. Damage. How much damage also, did you take? I'm rolling it How now. much damage did you say, Lois? Uh, 40 okay, seconds go ahead. now. So, what were you um, saying? Bitch, if I may, bonus action pocket... <sighs> not bonus action. Reaction pocket sand. That's another con save he's going to have to make. A 16. Lois, how much damage did you say? 16 slashing. Okay. Yeah. What would you say the AC, the, the thing was, Kit? Uh, it's constitution of 16 again. He, is, he rolled a 17. Damn it. All right. Give me a moment. Lois? Yes. Roll me wisdom. Hey. I'm so glad to have a bit of resilience wisdom. That is a natural 20 plus 8. That's a 28. Hey, Jess, you know you can unmute to ask these questions. I know, but I didn't want to interrupt. Because I'm, I'm trying to figure out this whole sneak attack thing and how it logically works. Um, sneak attack, basically, if you have advantage or are flanking, you just add the damage. Hold on. Wait, is, um, I'm not hey, finished. Pete? Yes, Kit. I'm so, I, um... This is, I think, the only second the ta second time I've used Pocket Sand. Hold on, I'm just going to copy its description. I, I know is... what it is. I've used it before. I know, but hold on. Did he do it with... Yeah. I'm pretty sure Dale would be very proud. 
Um, I used pocket sand in the bandit encounter, remember? Okay. Oh, okay. Yes, JT? When did you use that spell? Me? Yeah, you. Not in this campaign. No, I mean, like, just when? Um, what campaign? I think it was in the IRL campaign that I was in. Why? Be careful about using that spell because you just want to I know. Yeah, and it's not it's never been play tested. I just sort of made it because I as a joke named the character <laughs> Dale. So just I know. It's, it's, I think it might be over. I guess not actually you may want to that with yeah, Dale. I let my I asked my DM about the, at the time about it, he said it was fine. I guess right. my main question was since he was attacking and that's when I did it, did it did he do it at disadvantage? Yes. Okay. The first like, one was an at 20. Good god, what the fuck? Also, who roll initiative, he sees you. Okay, so I never did get to do that sneak attack? No, okay, sneak attack isn't just something like this once per act, like once per round, once per turn, or once per combat, sorry. you push Every round, you get to use it as long as you have the right parameters, so it's like... Yeah. It's not just a one-time use. Do you see, no, what oh I was trying God. to do... 17. And what I was trying to do is, I thought sneak attack, where if you're unseen, you could attack using sneak attack. Is Am I wrong with that? Mm, um, it depends on what weapon you're using. So, like, if you are quote-unquote hidden, and then attack, um, yes, I think it would be sneak attack, I believe. But sneak attack, like, if you're using, if you're using a melee weapon... There's a certain round of, like, unless you're a swashbuckler, but we don't talk about swashbuckler because you're not a swashbuckler. Um, someone else swashbuckler, be, sorry. Someone else will be, 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 be within five feet, or, like, I think it, um, or they have to be prone, I think? I, I need to look, I need to double check rogues. Oh, God. Oh. Bro, knows this better than I do. Because I was planning on shooting. Didn't he, didn't he technically done sneak attack early because it says finesse or range? Yeah, fin range, yeah, that's why it's, it's finesse or range, because, like, I'm talking about ranged, but, um... You will still be, like, I th because we are flanking, because, okay, I'm back. because because Brooke and Alina are both within five feet of this guy, um... Well, they were. You well, well, they were. were. Because, but because they are close, I believe, like, let me just check, if they are within five feet of this guy, oh, they were, um, so if Brooke or Alina he are, still, or anyone else, speed. yeah, he's still got less moves because he has need to take his, uh, but, um, He's slower now. Haha, <laughs> sucks to be you. Anyway, um... He had 60. Now he's at 50. Uh-huh. Also, Jessica, you missed. Wait, what did I roll for? You rolled a 17, didn't you, to hit? No, I rolled that for initiative. Oh, I thought you were trying to hit him. Well, it's AC. No, I was, I was just... <laughs> Burb. Sorry. <laughs> I, I wanted to sneak attack. But I'm just trying to figure out, like, the things that surround sneak attacking and how that actually works. Wait, where the fuck is the initiative counter? Um, I can DM you the parameters for sneak attack if you want. Where the fuck is the initiative counter? No, I'm counter? reading it. Okay. I'm able to read it, and that's what I was reading, and so I, I was just, very confused. I can't, I can't enjoy anything, can I, Roll20? Can I? You just won't let me have it, will you? No fun allowed. Oh. Well, if you need a simplified version, I can always just give it to you. Give me a fucking minute. Alrighty. Oof. And yes, bro, I would like that, even though I'm probably never gonna look at it again. Okay. Sneak attack, like, it. rogues are a very simple class on the surface, but sometimes learning sneak attack is a very, uh, weird thing. Because it's very fucky, because it's called different weapons at different parameters. Because what I thought was with a bow, as long as you're not seen, you're able to use it. There's more to it than that, but that, that but, is, I think, a part of it. But I, again, it's... That is a part of it. Yeah. 
again, rogues are pretty easy for the most part. Like, once you get the hang of their most complex thing, which is sneak attack, they're usually a breeze after that. Peach is dying. Always. Her, her banjo, Hello. her banjo country. Hello. Hello. Okay. I can round things up to, you know, three things. Should I just attack with my plus one short bow just to make things It's simple? your turn. That's... Just. I, yeah, I know. Attack with short bow. Do you really want to attack with a short bow? I have... Okay, fine. I'll stab him in the face. I'm only asking that because he's legit like 15 feet in front of you. <laughs> Uh, let me double check. Like, this entire time I was planning on a sneak attack with a bow, and so I'm just thrown through a loop. Um, I don't think you can do sneak attack with a bow. Yes, you, you can. can. I think you can. You can, it's ranged and fast. What? Yeah, yeah, I think it's like, but you can't use what? the bow as ranged. You have to be within 30 feet. But that's my what? pathfinder. Topic. It could be different in 5e. Um, Are you fucking kidding me? I'm guessing your other DMs did something. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Re oh. That's bullshit. I it's not fuck. bullshit. It makes sense because rogues. No, are I'm saying it makes sense. I missed me. Oh. I've been fucked in the past. Oh. Oh, oh um, no. So, Oof. so from what I know about rogues, again, my first rogue was a ranged rogue. Uh, actually, my was my second one, but more melee. But anyway, so you can use it as long as you're in, as long as you um. I think you have to be within its range. As long as, as long as you're in the bow's range and you reach certain parameters with um, its ranged properties, you can use sneak attack. It's just that, like, finesse weapons, which are things like repairs and things like that, has slightly different parameters within melee versus range, because otherwise range would be completely broken. But, um, yeah, you can use bows and ranged for, like, short bows, long bows, and a few others for um, sneak attack. It says, also, it says okay. ranged weapons. Well, technically speaking, I think you can use a gun as Just well. Good. Huh. Go ahead and roll to hit with whatever attack you're doing. I'm still figuring that out because I have an idea. I'm just trying to. Because so would I would I have to roll disadvantage with a bow if I used a bow? You're not in melee range yeah. right now, so you're fine. Yeah, you're fine. Okay. So I could do a spell and then use bolt from a grave as a bonus, correct? Or does that not is that not how that works? Uh, credit action is a bonus action, so yes, I believe so, because it's Bolt the Grave isn't a spell per se, it's an ability, so you'll be able to use a spell, then bonus action using cunning action, and use Bolt from the Grave during it, I believe. Yeah. So, let's play this out together so I can figure out how to do this with spells. So, he's going to point at the centaur say fucker and cast hold the dead and then he needs to make a wisdom save of 14 mm -hmm. and then um after that i would so what would i do next somebody like help me out with this process you would most you would most likely use your bonus action because toll of the dead costs an action to cast yes you can, yeah. you, you can use your movement speed or use the bonus action to disengage while casting bolts from the grave so isn't that how i have to do it yeah. action cunning action bo bonus action no cunning, action, that is, order. cunning Cun action cunning action is your bonus action so don't i have to do the cunning action before bolts from the grave though that's what i'm asking the cunning action yeah. is what activates it ish yeah Okay, so you he's attack, going to point at him. Cunning action, and then you use bolts of the grave. Yeah, and okay, cunning action you. is dash, disengage, or hide. Um, okay, so he's going to point at the dude, say fucker to cast Toll the Dead. He needs to make a 14 uh, wisdom save. I got a 16. That's fine. And then he's going to disengage and then shoot bolts from the grave, which is a plus seven. Make sure also when you use your spells that you're taking care of yours. Um, your spell what slots. the fuck are they called? Spell, spell slots. Oh, that was a uh, cantrip. Cantrip. Thank you. Okay. 
Just reminding you, just in case. I know too much about this and then I got a nat one on the hit, so he's he's like, I don't want to fight this thing, and it's clear. If you disengage, move your token away. Okay, one moment. I'd actually recommend taking the hide action so he could hide behind the rock again, but... I think he's being at the center, so you really can't hide. Unless Good point. Like enough color or dashing, can... like, yeah. would work as well. He's gonna move up. Let's do so yeah, he pretty much misses. He he goes to do everything. He doesn't hear the bells, and it's clear that his his arrow misses, and he's just like, I don't want to do this. I am fucked. As he's looking at this dude, Seriously, clearly probably way terror. taller than him. Oh, he towers over you. He towers over yeah. all of you. I believe it. He his high his his horse part. Um, I guess you could say. Like, the shoulder of where the horse part is, is as same height as Gizmo. And then he has an extra height from his human part, not to mention his antlers. <laughs> yeah. So he's he, just staring up at this thing, like, oh, hi. He's quite tall. He towers over every single one of you. Good to know. JT, it is now your turn. Genius can't be rushed, my friend. Yeah, Seriously? no, I see you using Sorry. your I see you using your ruler tool there. <laughs> the frog oh, yeah. 35 feet. I think I'm good. Oh guys, also, please, for my sanity, make sure your token is in a square. Oh, all right, I'll do that. Would you mind if I move it forward a little bit? I'm gonna move my yeah, no, speed, you go ahead. I think it's a close. Just so I personally don't lose my fucking mind. Um, I don't care. Like, let's say your movement speed is thirty feet. If the square is thirty-one, just move it the extra one foot. It's okay. What are you doing, JT? I'm gonna make sure I'm actually ten feet away on the map. You're like ninety you mind, away from me. Would you would you mind if I stay in this square just because if I move ten feet away I'm gonna be yeah, like half a bit square? We'll assume I'm, I'm ten feet away. Yeah, I'll just go ahead and say that you're I'm 10 not feet close him. to people. I'd like to hunters mark him, then attack him twice. Hunters mark gives you an extra bonus, doesn't it? Gives me extra one d a on a I hit. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's too much right there. That'd be an 11 and a natural 1 equaling 9. Yeah, so you miss. Also, guys, I'm not in a bad mood, I swear. I'm just getting really annoyed with roll 20. It's okay, roll 20's a bitch and it knows it. Understandable. Roll twenty. I I need to learn roll twenty. I sh I should someday. It will be blah 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 blah. Words are hard. Will that be the end of your turn, JT? It will be. All right. It is now kids' turn. Yay. All right. Jessica, I need you to come to my house where I am in the middle of nowhere. And I need you to give me the fruit roll that's right across the room from me. <laughs> Only if you pay me. <laughs> what? <laughs> Services. I need you to use your teleportation powers to appear in my room right now. And then I need you to give me the fruit roll that's literally five <laughs> feet away from me. <laughs> Kayla has the teleportation. I don't. I have the nature and ice. Remember that? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Paid long term butler. <laughs> <laughs> long distance, sorry. No, trust me. If you guys saw how much of a butler I am to her sometimes, it's accurate. I'm an unpaid butler. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> anyway. Um anyway. I'm going. Where are you going? Sorry. Um, I'm not going anywhere. I'm staying right where I am, and I am- it's gonna look weird, but I am going to howl. And as I howl, uh, how many do appear? Um, some dire wolves appear. Conjure animals. How many? 
Um, some. Hold on. Two, because Trick. it's CL one. This is two. The CL one and the uh, you summon two uh, two animals that CL one. I know spell too well. Please help. Okay. A dire Thank wolf you. is CR one. Yeah. Yep. CR one is like is higher than you think. That's saying that like an entire party of first level characters have to work together to beat it. Oh, okay. Approximately. Yeah, then, let me. Sorry, this is my first time using conjure animals. I should have read on it a bit more than I. Make sure it's fine. They... I I use conjure animals a decent amount, so like I know the spell decently well. Okay, so I need to roll um initiative for them as a group. Yeah. Hey, they... I have a question real quick. How many turns has it been since the first in... since he started with Darius? It's like turns or rounds. Hold on, I've been keeping track of this. Rounds. One. No, it's no, not it's been no, one. It's been more no, it's been than like one. Like two. Two. Because we hang out. No, uh, it's no. been three. So, yeah, because it's like, when three. Alina when Alina starts, it'll be three, right? Yes. No. no okay. Four, I think. When yes. It? It'll be four. Because, it'll be four. Because yeah, because it Even was better. Be because we had because we had um, originally it was Darius, oh, Kit, right. and the Lionel. Then it was Alina. And Bowie then, and they, and they joined okay. in. Okay. Then it's been the round with the rest, and then Kenneth joining in, and now we're on the fourth one now with the with with the whole with the whole group. Okay, thank you. For you. It's fine. So, oh, let me look at this. What is their... Let me check. Fuck, what is there in it? <sighs> Hold on. Uh, it's just, it's just, it's just 1d20 plus okay. their... It'll be 1d20 plus their dex modifier, whatever. Yep, says. so that's a plus two. Um, the, they have an eight in the initiative. God damn! So that's that's be just before you. You have the same just as Orca. <laughs> All right. Um, how many are you summoning? It's two direwolves because they're CR one. You're really gonna make me suffer and put more tokens <laughs> on this goddamn board. I could have made it wool just wolves. Oh, that, that, that would have been yeah. Eight, that would have been eight wolves. That would have been eight wolves. <laughs> actually, you know, actually, no, wait. You know what we can do? We can use this. <laughs> we can use these. <laughs> 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 no. <laughs> How dare you disgrace your own son like that? <laughs> hey, you take him away, you put him back, right, Brooke? <laughs> Oh my god, I'm, I'm, I'm putting them- I'm, I'm, put, I'm making it so that they're flanking. <laughs> Give me a second. I'm trying to load something, but Roll20 doesn't like my goddamn internet. You know what? Put Colvar back on the board because I'm going- <laughs> God damn it! Here we go. Here, have some Colvars. God. Have a Colvar, have two Colvars. Colvar 1. Call of R2. <laughs> Where's the goddamn initiative counter? <laughs> there it is. Thank you. <laughs> Call while you live on in the afterlife in the form of the dire wolf. <laughs> what did you roll for your initiative for them? They, they, they're on initiative eight right before me. Hey, Kit, what's, what's, that, what's the HP? Dire wolf's HP is each. Hold on, damn it. Um. Uh, 37. It's higher than Colvar's. <laughs> Stop. The way Lois said that, I had to. I had to. Okay, no, what was, it? What was it, Kit? Um, it, uh, 37 hit points each. And... And they have pack tactics. Well, yeah, they're a canine. Most of them do. I'm just I'm sorry. Okay, can can you guys see the HP HP bars above them? Yes. Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, how do you oh, do that? Gonna be, is that going to be the end of your turn? Um, hold on. I've got some bonus action to use. Um, oh, this is going to be so much fun. Yeah, no, I Not bonus action really. frostbite again. It's a bonus action? Wait, wait, why is it bonus action? No, goddamn, I'm an idiot. I'll say Shalele. I'm a fucking Let's idiot. Say, uh, no, I was I thinking of Shalele. I meant to say. Bonus. I know. I'm bonus action. Play Lele. I'm okay. sorry. I'm a dumbass. No, you're fine. We're all dumbasses. Is Don't that going to be the end of your turn? Are you going to move? What are you doing? Um, nah, I'm staying right here still. Alina, it's your turn. Hey. Well, first she could like, kind of like just glance to Brooke when she howls, just like, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> For a second. 
Uh, <laughs> That's just, how I act. Just like, just like, obviously, obviously, embarrassed, but just more, just like, hi, why I'm, why I'm around. Okay. Uh, well, first things first, I'm just gonna just bonk, and also remove my prone status. I'm no longer prone. Uh, where is it? There it is. Yeah. <laughs> um. And. Oh my god. Uh, pew pew twice and. Roll the hit, please. Uh, 2d20 plus 13. That is a 26 and a 17. 17. Only one of them hits. That's fine. If only one of them hits. Good to know. Uh, what's my damage? 1d8 plus 8. That's for dying damage, and then action surge attack twice again. Roll to hit. Ow, that's in that one. Ouch. Bad call. That's, uh, but that, the other one is 18 plus 13. That is uh, 28, 29, 30, 31. Mm -hmm. No, I'm sorry. That one doesn't hit either. Fuck! <laughs> what are we facing? A Tarrasque on steroids? <laughs> yeah, obviously. That's another nine! You motherfucker! <laughs> <laughs> It looks like you're fighting the mighty nine. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> but we nine or That's still eighteen. That's, important thing. That's still eighteen damage in total. And um, uh, let me just move action switch from my stuff because I don't need to use that. JT, uh, you're gonna be happy in a second. Are you putting a really big mini on the board? Because that would make me happy. No, you're gonna get. You're gonna use, get to use your favorite fucking ability in a minute. Uh, I thought you were gonna like do the attack because I like circles. It's Bowie's yeah, turn. Cool. Alrighty. Seeing how everyone's basically, you know, in the way of her field of view at the moment, and she doesn't want her, you know, spiritual weapon to fucking kill someone. Let's see how far she can actually move. Okay. There how you go. Many, what's her field of? What's her movement speed? Um, it's 30, but I can use feline agility to double it. Okay. So, yes. Jump up here. I yeah, do have that. Yeah, sorry. Um, there we go. Right next to my last javelin, and how far am I from this guy? Okay. Gonna attack with spiritual weapon again. And considering that he's being flanked from, you know... All sides, I'm pretty sure I have advantage. I think. Is that how that works with javelins? No, I'm not using a javelin. I'm using spiritual weapon. I don't Unless... know. That's a JT and Lowe's question. Unless spiritual weapon doesn't. Uh, I think that's the equivalent. I think it's the equivalent of it's like a melee spell attack, in which case it counts as a melee attack. So yeah, it would get a flanking. Bonus. All right, roll advantage. Okay. Plus six. E. That's a 25. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hold it. I almost rolled a d20 of damage. Dear Lord, no. <laughs> I I got another one again. Okay. Let's Spear go. What the fuck yeah. is this night? What is this shit? The ancestors want me to use a pool move. <laughs> the yeah, ancestors... That be the end of your turn? Uh, yes, that's all I can do for now. All right, JT. Um, I have a question. Yeah. So he's moving away from y'all. Um, so that gives you opportunity of attack. I'm pretty sure that gives the dogs opportunity of attack. It gives everyone in range opportunity of attack. Uh, would I get advantage because me and the northern dog uh, are flanking him, but he is moving out of like the flanking distance. No. Yeah, no, go ahead. So, Kit, go ahead and roll uh, to hit for the two the wolves. Alright, and both of those would be at advantage yeah. because pack tactics. Wait. Wait. Fear. They didn't do disengage. Fuck. That's Guys, we need to 
21 hits. Then get back to where you were, buddy. Wait, what? Sentinel, remember? Oh my fucking god! Oh no. <laughs> so he can't move at all from where he just was. Yeah, he, Sentinel. His speed has been reduced to zero until I believe the start of this next turn. Sentinels and no U to movement. Uh. I'm going to keep you saying this, but if you want to be one for doing the damage. Yes, kid. Okay. okay. One. I said roll the hit first. Okay. Then. Also, on. make a dex. I need everyone. I need the this dog beside Darius. I need Darius and Alina to all make a dex save. Just a moment. All right. Oh, wait. Do the dogs need to make a deck save? Sorry. Yes, just the one beside Darius. The other one does not. I'm back. Lois, make a deck save. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'm good at this. Can't wait till I get that one bullet. It makes me, like, tougher against my, my Slayer's Prey. That'll be fun. Oh. Well. It's an 18. So, I deal 22 damage. With my reaction okay. attack. Okay. And I got a 17 save. Give me a moment. High five. High dex. <laughs> well, saving throw. Um, and uh, that only first. Only... Wait. That first attack that what the dogs did hit, right? Which was a 22? Yes, that one hit. All right. What do you see? Nine. Okay. JT, or not JT, Darius and the wolf did not make their deck save. It's pretty steep. I'm a really small bit afraid now. Damn. You want, you want, hey, what? where's my, that, where's that one specific dice? Oh, look, is this the one? Mm -hmm. No, that's a D8. That's not what I need. That's not what I need. That's a D20. <laughs> D20. Where the fuck is my dice? Everywhere. That's a D10. I don't need you. Where the fuck is it? Are you looking for a D100? No, I'm looking for a D12. Oh. Oh. Oh, good die. Oh. Where the fuck is it? Did I lose it? If I did, I'm going to be extremely pissed off. I cannot find the, D the D12 for my Lesbian Pride die set. I'm <gasps> going to be no. so incredibly mad. Oh no. And oh, Claude doesn't want to kill us yet. Alright, that's one. Two. And a three. All right. Uh, both Darius and the dog are taking twenty points of fire damage. Oh, taking... Alina, half damage, I guess. You take. No, you don't. You're not going to take any. Um. You see the smoke coming from this thing's mouth, and you're like, "Oh, fuck!" And you quickly hide behind the rock just quick enough to not get hit as the thing just spews fire um at the dog at the wolf and Darius. <sighs> Give me a second. Also, Darius, Alina, make wisdom saves. Oh, isn't that fantastic? JT, we got this. We bo we, bo we both wisdom based in some way. We we got this. Mm, no, you might. But I have only a high wisdom, no proficiency. You saw the DC of that of that um, fire blast. I don't think a plus three is going to see me salvation here. Unless I'm we'll see. 
that's a nat one for me. Okay, you know what? JT, you got this. No. JT, you, you said it's going to save me. Oh, okay. We, 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 if we go down, we go down together. If we go down, no. we go down together, JT. No. Hey, Lois, yeah. JT. Yes? Meet me in my torture room. Oh, no! no. <laughs> Why couldn't this be me? Ooh, I'm so fucking trip. curious. Ooh. JT. Wait, is, it, is this my first trip to the torture yes, room? It is. Let's go. I think it, like it is. Oh god. I oh, call see Max. You. See you guys on the other side. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Fia. Yeah, yeah. I'm Fia. JT's common collective, and Peach is just giggling like a maniac over there knowing that she's screwed us both over. I'm sure I'm sure to everyone right now I seem like in a very bad mood because I'm not getting my way but I swear I'm not in a bad mood. I'm very I'm enjoying myself a lot right now because you guys aren't doing any damage to him at all. Um, I'm yeah. enjoying myself because you guys finally got to the plot. <sighs> and I mean, even if your plans get like screwed over, it can be fun. Yeah, like oh, I yeah, enjoy no. like seeing my, my players succeed. I don't enjoy I don't enjoy wrestling with roll twenty. <laughs> you, yeah, no, my plans have not been failed. The only thing that you stopped, JT, was he was gonna move beside Alina and everyone that's in that little group right there was gonna get hit by that fire attack. So you saved three other people. But we didn't save ourselves. By not letting him move. Because I'm amazing in every conceivable but way. He... <laughs> McKinley. Um, so he turns he he goes to run and immediately the two wolves attack him and you attack him Darius and stop him and he turns and looks at the both of you and he makes eye contact just long enough before he spews his flames Darius as the flames just go completely over you like you're you're covered in flames um you hear a voice in the back of your head it's a very calming soothing voice and it's a it's a female it's a woman talking to you she says to come find her she's waiting for you she can't wait to meet you and in your head you see just black. You don't see anything. For a moment, you see the flames coming towards you, and then just black as you hear this woman's voice. Alina, yeah. you see these flames start to come out, and you duck behind the rock. But just like Darius, you saw, you looked into the eyes just quick enough, just enough that it affects you as well. Your vision goes black as well, and... You hear the same fe female voice in your head. It's calm and it's soft. And she says to you, Come find me. I need you. And both of you feel a sense of fear, but, but calm. You yourself, your body is calm, but you feel your heart beats trying to beat out of your chest. You are both calm and full of fear at the same time. Oh. And then as just as quickly as your vision goes black, you can see again um, JT. Since you are in the flames, if you want to take an action or do anything... JT. What... <laughs> JT just appears out of nowhere to help us. Yeah, JT disappears. The Hawaiian Shore is Stranger's back, guys. Um, what is the rules of being covered in fire? Like, do you have to take an action to put it out? What is the rules on that? Well, am, I, am I on fire? Yeah. Because if like you're covered in fire, in... like, usually you just take damage. But if you catch fire, the rules are different. I mean, you were in the direct path of the fire. So in this instance, I'm going to say you're on fire. Uh, usually I have to take a turn and you can use your action to put yourself out. Okay. Like on your turn, like on the start of your turn, you take, it's usually 1d6, but it's up to the DM, the effect. 
and you have to use an action to. Okay. I think it's usually DC ten dexterity save to put yourself out. Okay. So yeah, when when your turn comes around, I'll just say a D six and then roll to see if you pass the thing. But yeah, that's what you guys see. Your vision goes black. You see those eyes. Um, you see the same eyes as the centaur in front of you in the blackness. That's all you see. Black and then those eyes staring at you. You hear the woman speaking to you. And then everything comes back and you're back on the fight. Huh. I'm too busy suffering to pay any mind to that. I'm on fire. I'm fighting a big, <laughs> ugly, big, fat, green, stinky green jerk. <laughs> Man, that's, green. That, that's my physical appearance. <laughs> He's not green. No, he is. Well, he's going to be red here pretty soon. <laughs> hey. All right. I'll meet you back over there. But will you? Yeah. Will we go, though? Oh. <laughs> da -da -da. Hi, guys. Hi. Hello. Hi, I'm scared. It's fine. Don't yeah, sorry, worry. We were shit. I was yelled at not to make eye contact, so I'm not going to be a dumbass. I didn't yell at you. I <laughs> No, you, can... you have no proof. You can do whatever you want. It's just yeah, you can do whatever you want. I'm just like. <laughs> oh, hey, Battle Cats is happy. I have been fucking up this whole time. This man has a proficiency bonus, and they haven't been adding on to it. Oh well. No. Oh. There's a few attacks I should have hit that didn't hit, but oh well. That's in the past. Mistakes are mistakes. That it just depends on how much you want to kill us. Yeah, how do you think I got here? I know, right? <laughs> I'm trying to find a specific gift, but I can only find that gift instead, so you don't want your you Sometimes a wrong gift. does make a right, JT. Silence, liberal. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. That is go also, um, for the ones for the others, you see Alina. For a moment, you think Alina has been engulfed by the flames as well. But um, as the flames stop, you see that she had ducked behind the rock and is completely fine. However, the dog is on, or the wolf, sorry. The wolf is on fire, and so is Darius. Like, fully engulfed in flames. Concerned about she, Darius? She's eh, showing pain. The dog's a fae. Also, it is now Kenneth's turn. Is Darius showing pain? I am on fire. fire. <laughs> yes, I am. I just, <laughs> I'm tough, not a mortal. Look, he's look, on so, fire. Look, after disappearing to Peach's torture room, you never know if it's a real fire or not. Yes, he's on fire. Even if it wasn't real fire, he'd still be in pain. Oh my god. Look. I have my reasonings. Because I know the one time I'm not going to ask a stupid question, that stupid question is going to be accurate. <laughs> what can you just put the chat? This ranges on fire. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, hold on. I have to do something. I have to do something very, very important to this moment. <laughs> but Kindle, you are a blessing. Hold on. Please never change. <laughs> I am on fire. <laughs> there you go. What did you do? <laughs> What did you do? Just famous quotes. Oh boy, how should Where's I pass? my oh there it is. <laughs> but I know the one time I am on fire. <laughs> I know the one time I don't ask one of these dumbass questions. That dumbass question is gonna be one hundred percent accurate. And nobody's gonna know. Uh-huh. I am so glad Subhuman has come, has come on right now. You cannot kill me. <laughs> I'm a bad bitch, you can't kill me. I'm All right. a bad bitch, it you is, can't kill me. It is the bird's turn. 
So in also, his yes, panic, he looks like he's on pain because he's on fire. Okay, just like I said, if I didn't ask it, it probably would have been the exact opposite for whatever reason. So anyway, without hesitation, he's going to um, cast Ember. I mean, uh, Sacred Flame by saying Embers and then like giving like a little like sassy hand motion is the easiest way I could. I could explain it like he's making like the ha- like the rain thing with like your hand anyway. And that's yeah. going to be a dex save of 14. He's then going to dash over here and then he's going to Where? shoot uh, Where's he going? Right right here. Why is he going- not clicking in You're going what? closer to him? I'm kind of moving closer to the dog. You're I'm really okay. I'm not gonna say anything. That's fine. Right there, I, I guess. I don't know. And then he's gonna cast bolts from the grave. You're gonna have to give me just a moment. Yeah, I know. Okay, so what am I doing for the the fire? Dex save a fourteen. I swear to fucking god. I swear. The world's like, oh, Peach is in a good mood. Ha ha ha. Not anymore. Ha 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 ha. It's, it's okay. I'll load my shotgun just and take out some bitches later. Don't worry. Okay, I'm rolling a dex of 14. Yes. That is a 17 without modifiers. Okay. Then Does he take half damage or no? Fuck, I forgot to even say that with the uh, other spell last time he did it. Because with Toll the Dead, it did, he missed, but that one is... If you miss Toll the Dead, you just miss. You don't take half damage or anything. Let me double check. If, is it? I know you don't because of, um, what's it called? Uh, Critical Roll. Oh, okay. Fucking Jester misses that spell so much, I know that one by now. If you miss with Toll the Dead, it doesn't do anything. You yeah. just miss. Yeah, Toll the Dead is like if you if it's injured, it does more damage. But if it's, it's a little like, but if it's, it's yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no. So with game. this one, if you miss, um, do you take half no. damage? I don't think no. no. I don't think many cantrips or okay. any cantrips do half damage. I think there's like maybe one or two, but I'm sure JT maybe could correct me on that. Anyway, okay. cash. Uh... Both in the grave. In the grave. 19. That's a hit. And then that is a spell. Seventeen. Damage points necrotic. And that's the end of his turn. Uh, give me just a moment. You said necrotic damage? Yes. Lois? Yes. Hi. 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 <laughs> 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 so, um, I was zoning out just checking Instagram for a second. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> she surpassed Windex Square oh Ball. She went full on, on and like squeaky. <laughs> 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 no, what was better? The picture or the sound that Lois made? She sounded like she was doing a spit take. <laughs> also, just so you guys know, just so you guys know, get cleared. <laughs> Just so you guys know, he barely looks hurt. 
Like, he doesn't seem to notice any of the things that you're doing to him. <laughs> yeah, it's accurate. Also, he's still got brambles. Also, also, he's, also, he's still got brambles on him, so, like... Yeah. To, too bad he's not been able to move, right? He's moved one time, and then Darius had to come in like, ah, haha, yeah, no, you're not moving anymore. Honestly, it's a good combo, though, because it's like, oh, if Darius can't make him move, I'm just like, you move, you die. <laughs> they are both the of you move, you die. <laughs> and then there's also the doggos. Alright, right, it is now Darius' turn. I am on fire. <laughs> Kindly roll for damage, Dungeon Master. It's a d6, correct? Well, that's up to you. It varies by effect. It's usually a d6, though, so I, I assume so. Oh, uh, that's a 6. Ow. I know it's a 6, because on the dice that McKinley gave me, oh, darn, there's a special it. symbol on it for the highest max damage. It's just a d4. It's a really just it's a cool tree inside of a shield. That's, that's like to be a picture of that or something. Like, I want to see what that looks like. That sounds really cool. I will do it after the stream. Thank you. But I did realize a stupid pick thing with the memes. Darius says, get flamed, bitch. And then he turns into the flame. <laughs> get flamed, bitch. Are you okay? I am on fire! <laughs> what kills me is the, is the mouth. The, fuck, the fact that, like, it's not, even just like, it's not even just, like, a little mouth. It's, like, the full-on, like, really cartoony, like, full-on... <laughs> <laughs> it's me. I also. love you. <laughs> I need a whole animated series where it's just stick figure Darius <laughs> and overly animated hoot face. No, no. Everything is right, the same, but uh, stick figure Darius. Burb. What were you saying, Burb? There's, there's two kinds of, you know, fire that I can see. There's one which just deals, you know, base damage of 5, which is oil fires, and a d4, which is alchemist fire. <laughs> well, that's, well, the, well, that's like item fire. This is not, this is like breathing yeah, no. fire. Well, that's fire. the it's version fire. alchemist fire. This is the Chad Lionel fire. Yeah, also, I know. Chad, you're still on fire. <laughs> it's just a reference. You no, I'm put, not. You I would like to cast Stop, Drop, and Roll. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do you actually pat yourself out? <laughs> I am on fire, yes I do. <laughs> Yeah, uh, it's usually an action. Great, we're gonna great. Oh I'm God. gonna go find us something. What was that roll for, JT? <laughs> roll for performance. Concentration. For. Hunter's Mark. Oh. Did you fail? Yeah, I did. The DC is 10. Okay. Ooh. But God gave me more than three spell also, slots for a reason. Yeah, go ahead and use your action to put yourself out. The dog, however, can't do that, so the dog is still on fire. No, fuck. Oh, are you kidding me? What did you do? <laughs> I rolled a six. I don't think that puts me out. No, it doesn't. Well, fine. Fire's a good look on me. Darius is on fire. He will now stop by... He will now stop being on fire. He will now stop by fire. Alright, is that going to be the end of your turn, JT? Oh, I'm not gonna be. I'm not gonna recast Hunter's Mark. That'd be stupid. So okay, yeah. It's a uh, one of the direwolves turn. This one. Uh, well, it's technically both. Oh shit! God fuck. Okay, which which, well, which which one got hurt? By the way, the one that I pinged goes first, and the one that's beside Darius is hurt. Cool. How much damage did it take again? It was twenty, wasn't it? It was twenty. Okay. So yeah. There we go. Yeah. Uh. Also, aren't yeah, you glad I didn't roll a nat 20 on that? <clears throat> Good boys. Um, anyway. <laughs> Doggos, People do need things. to stop pinging me! Okay. What were you saying, Kit? Doggo numero one, oh wait, two because, is going to attack. Yeah. Wait, wrong, sorry. Uh, whatever, 15 plus 5 is 20. Why did you roll 2d20? Pack tactics. Right? Yeah, pack tactics gives you advantage on the roll. So he got a 17. No, oh, no 15 plus 5. So yeah, yeah, he got it. Roll for damage. Um, eh. 
12. Okay. Right, that's doggo numero one. Hey guys, uh, he's not in triple digits anymore. Woo! Okay. Okay, and next. Oh, it's damaged like ours. That means he's almost dead. Oh my. Peach, it appears we're both having computer issues. Uh. Anyway. I'm not having computer issues. My computer is fine. It's my shitty ass internet that's being powered with Angels. Close enough. Close enough. Shh, it's fine. Shh, it's fine. Okay. Do go numero. Um, dos. <laughs> numero dos. Uh, can he attempt to put himself out? No. He's a dog. He doesn't know. Or he's a wolf. He doesn't know. He's a fae. Um, yeah, so. Good point. It's under my control, <laughs> technically speaking here, but like, whatever. It doesn't really matter anyway. Because, um, doggo go attack. Actually, wait, do I need to take fire damage first? Uh, yeah, you do. Hang on. That's oh. a five. He still lives. Not for long. <clears throat> He's... Rolled a hit. There we go, I did it right this time. God, that was 219! <laughs> that is a hit. Go ahead and roll for damage. Eleven. Eleven. All right. Thank you. That can be the end of the those turns. Now it's your yeah, turn. They're nibbling on his legs. Okay. Your turn. Yay. Um. You can see um as the dog as the wolves are attacking him. You can tell that it hurts, but it looks as if he couldn't give two shits. Ah. <sighs> kind of mumble underneath my breath. What the fuck? And, uh... Mm, that is... Hold on, let me check something. Yeah, that's concentration. What you trying to do? Uh, no, I was just checking things to make sure. Uh, uh, second level ice knife. You sure you want to do that? Oh, right, shit, everyone's close together. You want to do that? No. Why is everything concentration? Fuck druids. I'm joking, I love druids. I, uh, wait a second. Oh, this is stupid. Um, fuck it, I'm running up to it since I have Shalele on right now, right here. Why does every one of you want to give him a hug? What the <laughs> fuck are people doing? I'm a ranged fighter. I don't want to give him a hug. Thinking here, what like, the oh, God, fuck are you fun. people doing? Don't judge me. We're bear hugging him to death, apart from me, because I'm ranged. Wait. Wait, no, can I take back what I said? No, it's too late. You already moved. Shit, fuck, man. Well, yeah, whatever. It's, it's, um, it's, it's set in motion. I'll put it out of... <laughs> you piss me. Huh. See, oh, I, no. I don't want to hug it. I want to have a staring contest with it. Um, who looks the but most nice injured out of all of us, mean. actually, really quick here? Darius. I don't know. Darius. Um, fuck So, it. you're gonna- weren't you gonna hit him? I was thinking about it, but I moved close to him. Hold on, let me- Um, Bonk. I actually move a little more- I move around the rock and I'm- Would that put- if I go next to Darius, would I be on fire? I don't think so. Also, okay. do you have the movement speed? I have you the were movement speed. The I, moved, I moved, like- I was like right here ish, and I only moved to right here. Make yeah. sure you make sure you use the measuring tool. Yeah, you wouldn't be able to get to Darius. Really? Because you could go around the rock. Um, what? What is your movement speed? No, I'm just like wondering what is. What did you set this? I'm sorry, because these aren't the actual squares. I'm just confused. Five that's foot. all. Each each square is five foot. So each square is five foot. So that's one, two. 
20, 25, 30. I would be able to, yeah. No, no Kit, because you were up here in the corner. You were, I don't think you'd be able to make it. No, I was like right here. Yeah, you were still there. there. And then to get here. So if that's 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, I would be able to make We're not going by scores, we're going by map distance. We are? I thought we were going Yeah, the ruler by is correct. Somebody by... No. Oh my god, I'm so confused. We're going by map so rule 20, map distance, says... not squares. Hey. Never mind then. Sorry that I don't know what to do now. Because you got confused, if you want to stay up in the corner where you were, I no, will you No, no, it's fine. It's fine. If you want to move back to where you were, you can. I'm letting you do it this one time because you were confused. So if you want to move back, do it now. Sure, fine. There right. you go. Here, I don't know what else to do. I... Is that going to be the end of your turn? Or do you still No, because I, have, I haven't done anything technically. Okay. <sighs> I don't want to hit them with that because that's concentration. That's uh, pocket. You know, they could. They're not pussies. They can take an ice knife. My previous offer about peeling your skin from head to toe still stands. <laughs> <laughs> Just because we're tough doesn't mean you should hasten us to our grave because we're taking the hits for you, buddy. Let me check what you can. Oh, oh dear. Most druids spells are druid spills concentration. I, mean, I, mean, I can't beat the shit of you without getting closer. I mean, frostbite's still a valid option because it's. Uh, frostbite's still a valid option, but I'm thinking here. Yeah, you I'm can still do frostbite. Um, God. Actually, yeah, you know what? You guys may not. You guys apparently are pussies, so I'm doing frostbite instead. So, well, con save. I wish, roll, I wish roll 20 would give you an option to make like, a circle. Not just a fucking square. You call us pussies, but you're the one hiding in the back casting weak cantrips. Shut the you're fuck up. You're too lame to try and get in here with a shillelagh. I'm trying not to hurt you or remove concentration honestly, from the doggos. Honestly, honestly, Frostbite's really good because disadvantage on their next attack roll is. Yeah, it, it is. Cantrip. Yeah, I. That's why I used it originally in the first place. So yeah, um, con save. Give me a second. This is the very bad shape. Oh. I just need it for my mental note. What's the circle mean? I, it's something I was trying to do earlier. Hopefully this doesn't delete a lot of people. Okay, cool, good. Where am I trying to save um, for the con? What's the uh, 16. 16, okay. Why that is a 17 me? without modifier. God fucking damn it. We need to stop having Peach use legit dice. Just, just quickly, touch them, curse them, do I, it. She jokes can't. Jokes on not you! Them. I was I'm... there when she picked them up. Crap. <laughs> that only happened. That only worked once. That only worked one time, and I don't wow. use that set anymore because of it. <laughs> wow. To this day, when I roll with that set, they still roll shit. <laughs> quickly, every now and then I'll on. pick it up. All right, is that going to be the new turn kit? Trying to look at Wait, what. What did you use? Did you roll use ice knife? No, that was uh, frostbite. frostbite. Oh, okay. Frosty bite. Which I think I'm going to get if I keep if I'm really being as cold as it is. Oh, <sighs> that's yeah. That's all I'm doing. I don't have anything I can do. Okay, it is now Alina's turn. Uh, well, after, like, pretty, like, getting up, well, like, kind of after ducking behind the rock and getting back up from d avoiding the fire and seeing, ah, oh, shit, Darius is on fire, and now, and the dog's on fire, but dog, the dog's not real. In a sense. It's real, but not real. Uh, well, I'm just gonna just go, I'm just gonna, Darius, I'm sorry, and grab her, and she's just, like, chuck, like, for just run over and just sprinkle the water skin over to put him out. You know, using her action to put him out with 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 her water skin. 
Okay. And then, well, that'll be actually, let me just move my token actually, because I would have moved closer to that. Ah, no, fuck, wrong thing. Mm. Yes, this about as close as I can get. And just, you know, just, just chuck water, pretty much. Just water skin. Yeet! Um, and then, that's five foot of my movement, I think. And then, uh, I am going to, let's see, do I have any other abilities I can do? I don't think I can, because I may be a fighter, but if I can't fight, I'm pretty much useless <laughs> in sometimes. What I can do outside of combat when it comes to things like this. So, another thing I can just do is bonus action. So, I'm gonna just uh, back up again a little bit. Okay. So, you used your water skin to put him out, correct? Yeah, so it's waste a little water in it to put him out. All right, is that gonna be the end of your turn? Yes, it will be. All right, Bowie, it's your turn after a million years. Yep, alrighty. So, I guess I know what to do now. So, question. Mm -hmm. Do ranged spell attacks benefit from flanking? I don't I, think so. I would say no. I, I don't think JT, JT knows. I do not believe they do. Okay. So, never mind with the advantage, but I'm still going to do the thing that I want to do. So, seeing that Darius is now, you know, not on fire anymore, seeing how there's two wolves and a Kenneth blocking her way, is going to move a bit. Yeah, she's going to move over towards here. And she's going to cast Guiding Bolt onto the guy. What does Guiding Bolt do? Like, what's the type that it is? It's a, it's a ranged spell attack that deals radiant damage. It does radiant? Okay, thank yep, you. It, and I need to roll to hit for this, so oof. All right, let's go. Come on, not 20. Almost. 23, almost. It's a hit. Oh, sweet, sweet doublage. Oh, boy, fucking second level. Let's go. Oh, Let's shit. go, boys. That one, that one, that one, that one. Watch. <laughs> Fuck you, Lois. Fuck you if that I mean, actually happens. You guys have all been rolling once this whole time. So I know, that's why it I could say happen. Because our damage has just been really bad. Been Let's rolling... see it. Oh, God damn it. One. Okay, Eight, 18 radiant damage. There you go. That's not as good as I hoped, but oh well. <laughs> that's, that's, that's that's above average. Yeah, I know. Also, doesn't, that, doesn't Guiding Bolt mean that the next person gets advantage on their next attack roll now? Isn't that Guiding Bolt? Yep. So next person who's up, uh, you get advantage. How much damage arm. did you do? 18? 18 radiant damage, yep. Alright. You say next well, person is up gets the bonus. Yep. None of us are the next person. No, ne next person who no next person who's fighting next person on our side. I know. I look. I had to do something funny. All right. I I have been waiting for this for quite some time. I need Brooke, Hoot, Darius, Alina, and both wolves to all make a deck save right now. Oh, I God, just put him out. <laughs> <laughs> just put him out. So the saving throw is un is under the box titled saving throw, right? Just yeah. double nineteen. Checking. Yes, it is. Um, I'm on fire. I am on fire. <laughs> You're oh, water. No. You're water, Nazi. Just wait. Just wait. Just wait. It's fine. You're gonna laugh. Roll for the wolves. Yep. Hold on. Sixteen. I just saw the drawing that Kimmy did of Corporate Eater, but it's between between me and a squirt bottle. There is no difference. <laughs> Both dogs are now on fire. Okay. Um, Alina and Darius take half damage. Oh, so this isn't fire. Oh, no. This is something else. <gasps> no. I'm down for this. So let me just get my box. Did it cast Fireball? On itself. Fireball! Hold on, let me just... Burr. Fireball go burr. <laughs> oh wait, no, not Kenneth. You're not special enough. You're not close enough. You don't get this. Aww. Oh. <laughs> Wait a minute! <laughs> you How don't much get farther am I compared to everybody else? 
Why is it filling it in? I don't want it to fill it in. What do you- Wait a minute. What the fuck? I just broke it hit, but I don't. Hang Close. on, because you're not close enough. But I... Hang on, hang on. She's within the square. You are not. That wasn't exactly. That square. That's a rectangle. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> it's the wrong okay, color. Okay, fine. Anyway. Fine. I hey, don't be it. mad that you didn't get hit. I have a reaction. Well, he'd save it because it, it's like because it does use a spell slot to use the reaction as a spell slot. So like you don't want to get hit all the time. All right, give me a moment. You know what? Yeah, no, it's fine. So, oh shit, fuck. That twelve. Oh no. <laughs> well, okay. So everyone who rolled so that means Brooke and the two wolves, you're all taking 27 points of fire damage. Dog numero dos is gone. Both of them or just one? Uh, the second one. Okay, so bonk. So 20. 27. You take 27, and the other wolf... Yes, JT? Delete. My <laughs> <laughs> kidney, I love you. <laughs> what am I supposed to be deleting? No, I'm not deleting. air one there for a reason. No, I'm not deleting. It gets to stay there. <laughs> <laughs> now I know how I make you feel. Except I already knew that because Lois already makes that feel that way because she keeps making tiny squares on my map and it's drive free and fade. I don't mean to. <laughs> so, McKinley, I need an entire short, sh short, where it's just the entire columnist crew with just that as their mouth. <laughs> okay, so Brooke, you take 27, the dog takes 27, um, whatever the hell is half of 27, that's what Darius and Alina take. Um, also, he are we rounding up or down? I keep forgetting our rule. Again. Sorry to interrupt. Up. 14. No, fine. Up. Okay, so he's also getting damaged. You see him. He looks around, sees that he is surrounded, and you see him. He looks very pissed. He doesn't look like he's in pain at all. All the attacks that you've been hitting him with seem to have not have affected him. And he is just going to. He fucking lets out a huge roar. And then he just, the whole area around him, that box, rectangle, just erupts in flames. Ow. <laughs> um, so, Brooke, the dog, or Brooke, the wolf, Darius, and Alina, you're all on fire. Damn, we, we, we were succeeding on deck save and we're still on fire. I just... Put him out! I just put him out! I just put him out! <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty funny, honestly. I have no water left. <laughs> Time to use the tidal wave. Exactly, tidal wave shower! <laughs> no! no. <laughs> Time to use me. What are you down. talking about? Alright. JT, do you want to do the thing again? And make me hate myself just a little bit more? Oh, absolutely. Well, too bad he's not doing it. Kenneth, it's your turn. Okay. Oh, if you will. Out of all Either three you run or of die, them, make your choice. Who looks the most injured, even though they're all set on fire? Probably right. Darius. Yeah. Darius is bloodied. He's okay. 
I have 10 HP. <laughs> well, to be fair, you're also hiding in the back, and you're a healer. Okay, so go for Brooke. Good to know. So, Kevin is going to use his... I'm the one who keeps you ungrateful fricks alive. <laughs> Listen, I can slap I myself and I'll be fine. True. But no, you please help me. out first. You... Okay. Darius, what is that doing? what? Okay, who looks more injured, Brooke or Darius? Let's see. In terms of total... 10 HP. In terms of total HP, Brooke, but Brooke can easily disengage and heal herself while Darius can't. Then I'm going for Darius. Okay, so Are he's going to use... to heal him? <laughs> I have a special trick off my sleeve. Anyway, I'm going you to use to my him. plus... No. Oh, oh. Just continue. He... I'm going to use his plus one of bow to attack the centaur. Okay. Which is... 19. You just hit. And damage... It's gonna take ooh full damage, uh, ten points of damage, well, almost full okay. damage. <laughs> uh, so, <laughs> look, five plus five, even number. So he's gonna take ten points of damage, and then as a bonus action, how the hell do I do healing light? I don't know. Read what this says. It, it's it's confusing me. You click it's on it harder. and you read it. Yes, and there's two different parts. Okay, it says you read have it. Two... Hold up. What's going on? No, like read it out loud so we can help. You, you. have two d6 healing pool that resets when you finish a long rest. As a bonus action, you could heal heal one creature you could see within 60 feet, spending dice from the pool, max, 3d6 at once. So do oh. I have 2d6 or 3d6? Okay, so. Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry, do you want to explain this? Or should you I? Ahead. Okay, so. Basically, you only have 2d6 in order to heal, heal someone. Your, the maximum that you can heal at one time is a maximum of 3d6. So you only have 2d6 to heal someone. And if you use a d6, you can save that d6 later for a different heal, or you can spend it all at once. So I'm not sure if that helps. Sorry. Then what's with the 3d6? I'm pretty sure as you level up your warlock, you can get more mm -hmm. dices to your healing pool. And the maximum you can heal at one time is 3d6. Okay, so if I use both of them, do if I you, click both boxes for uses? Technically, you spent all you spent all of your um, dices, so yes. Okay, so Darius heal two d six. I'm pretty sure each box is like a d six, so you can use that. So just so just roll the go use the bot for two d six. Not two d five six. Another ten. Okay. Also, Jessica, make me wisdom safe. I forgot to say when I was still a centaur turn. Hell yeah! Cool. Please let me possibly fail. Wisdom save is. One day, you're going to have to do something like this, and you're going to fail, and you're going to be happy about it, and I'm going to make you regret being happy. Peach, yeah. remember, my first ever death save was a nat one. Trust me, I know. Hey, meet me in my torture room. Okay. Oh boy. No oh boy. What's going to happen? Dun, dun, dun. Wait, so I'm guess 
Oh shit. I'm guessing this is background intimidation kind of thing that's happening. That's Wait, Lisa, you need to go there so they can see on stream. Yeah, this yeah. is huge. We could join in. Lois, I need you to yeah. join me too. I was about to say, I was about to say, Wait, shit, should I join in? <laughs> Okay, so, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay. And hello, chat. <laughs> okay. Well, you see this man, he just fucking roars at the top of his lungs, and obviously it's loud. And then you just see a, just a ball of fire surround him and the others. As he does this, though, you make eye contact for just just a second, and it's just enough. Your vision goes completely black, and you see a pair of eyes, um, the same eyes that the centaur has, just the black and red eyes, as well as the form of Zahor. You hear both his voice and a woman's voice talking to you. You hear the woman telling you to come find her. She needs you. She needs your help dearly. And then you hear Zahor, or at least you could have heard Zahor, but his voice is drowned out slightly. It's just, just enough that you can't hear what he's trying to tell you. You just see his face, or his two faces, as his form constantly switches between his life and death form. This lasts for a second, and then you can see again. Can I, like, am I able to tell, like, what facial expression he has? No, it's very for, uh, fuzzy, um, because he's switching back between the two so quickly, you can't see what he, what he what's on his face. Okay, so I'm gonna spring. Good to know. Say that again? Kenneth will be praying to Zahor tonight. Good to know. All right, goodbye. Bye. I tell you, those other three, I'm sort of glad when they leave. Oh, hey, guys. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Don't worry, we were just talking shit behind your back. Good. Yes. Yeah, Don't worry. It wasn't. About, it wasn't about you. It's just about uh, Peach. Yeah. Don't worry. I, no, oh, yeah? no, no, yeah, no, no, you, no, Peach. no, no. Talk to it. Oh, yeah? Exactly. I, I deserve it. I, I probably deserve it. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> True. <laughs> I'm very disappointed that okay. you didn't put like, down the. Said, just I kidding. I love you. You needed to put down the beholder or the mind flayer writing a beholder. Not <laughs> muting us. Come on. I thought you had class. <laughs> I did not I did not raise you this way. You raised me? Oh wow. You did a shit job. <laughs> you did a shit job. Have I told you my pl I mean have I told you about my plans if I ever have a kid? I, I know it. I know it. I know it. <laughs> Alright. Go Jessica, out for milk and never return. Jessica. Taylor. Is this the end of your turn? Uh yes, because that's my bonus action. Darius, it's your turn. As a wise man once said, Ooh, I'm on fire. <laughs> again. Just Alina, hey guys, you're out! Uh, and you're back on fire again. God, I just put him out! <laughs> oh no, I'm uh, on fire. Well, hey, I feel like I'm Oh fuck. As much as I want to keep going, like, <laughs> in character, Tyrius doesn't like being on fire, so he's just gonna. Uh, he's gonna try and pat himself out again. Go ahead and roll for it. Let me know what you get. I'm scrolling, looking for something. A 15. Quite respectable. You did it! You're not on fire anymore. I'm gonna take off my, my, my singed hat and throw it to safety. Far out of reach <laughs> of the monster. With a hateful glint in my eyes. <laughs> there he is. Prioritizing his hat. Cut my friends, <laughs> cut my flesh, touch my hat, and I'll peel your skin from head to toe. <laughs> I'm like Indiana Jones. Yes, That'll be the end of my turn. Because that's my action. Okay, give me a second. Also, just a reminder for chat. Lois, can you show us on screen, please? Where? This is what the eyes look like once it decides to load. 
<laughs> that is what beautiful. the eyes look like. Isn't it beautiful? Also, I'd like to mention, every single time that one of you makes eye contact with the centaur, he starts bleeding from his eyes. Oh, isn't that fantastic? Every time that you look at one of one of you look him in the eye, you see red lines continue to spread throughout his eye, showing that they're getting more and more agitated, and his blood continues to drip down his face. That's not healthy. <laughs> she doctor about that. It's not. Just ask Silver. <laughs> All right. It is now the wolf's turn. Doggo, don't fail me now. Hold on. What it's yeah, it's flanking with Darius technically, so it's still an advantage. Yeah, it is. Yes, yeah, so I'll just checking that for myself. <laughs> is it is it a melee attack? It's biting. It's a wolf, so yes. Hmm. Wait. Wolves have laser vision. Duh. Yes, Bird? Never mind. Um, Kenneth already used the advantage, if I recall. Mm-hmm. Okay. 19. I about that. 19 hits. I didn't even use advantage. Anyway. 11. Okay. Is that going to be the end of his turn? That's going to be the end of his turn, and he's on fire, so he needs fire damage. Oh, yeah, that's right. Three. He lives. Barely. He's at 7 HP. Yep. It's Brooke's turn. Yay. This girl is on... <laughs> also, um, you have to... If you need to, if you want to put yourself out, also, I'm rolling for your damage. You're taking 5 fire damage. Um, If you want to put yourself out, what were you... What was the save, JT? Dexterity save. Dex, you have to make a dex save if, if you wish to put yourself out. Could I use shape water from my uh, um, my water bottle thing and douse myself? I would say you don't have enough water to do that. Okay. If you want to put yourself out, you have to pat yourself down. Would that lower the DC? No. Damn it. Okay, just a straight 20? It's a dex thing. Oh, de okay, I didn't hear that, sorry. Fucker. My day I live. Yeah, you put yourself out. Bonus action. No. Frostbite again. Actually, wait, no, I do back up a little bit so I'm out of his range of the fire thing. It's fine, I, he can't do it again. I don't care. Brooke doesn't know that. <laughs> Frostbite. It's a con, con save, right? Con save of 16. That's not 20. Damn it. I am literally I've useless. learned. Don't let this Lionel make any saves. It failed the first time I made it do it. Yeah, you're right. First. Every other one after that has seemed to fail. Is that yeah. the end of your turn? That is the end of my turn. Alina, it's your turn. Okay, hold on. I've got... <laughs> I'm eating a cone right now. Leave me alone. I was, I was literally like, I was literally like, I'm multitask. I literally like multitask. So I was like, I was like combing my head because it was kind of in my eyes. And then as such, I started typing. So I had to like hold my comb in my mouth. So it was just like, <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> look, uh, anyway, um, okay, probably going to. Well, actually, no, I'm on fire, so I put myself out. Do the duck save. Out, that's an 11. I'm still on fire, I think. At me. Yeah, you're still on fire. Ow. Sugar. <laughs> Do you have any bonus actions? I don't think I have any boner actions. I, my, all my boner actions require me to hit. 
um, in some way or another. All right, so Bowie, like, it's your turn. Yeah, I'm just vibing there, just like, hey, oh, still on fire. Bowie. Bowie, all of Bowie, all of your teammates are on fire except for the bird. Except for the bird. Yep, I know. Uh, there's nothing I can do against putting out fires. Sadly, I'm best at causing them, but not putting them out. So. <laughs> Let's see. I'm going to refresh everyone's character sheet just to see how low everyone is at the moment. So I'm still at full health. Somehow. Okay, let me check again. So. So Darius can't be healed any further. And Brooke, let's see. I am dying. How much, how much health does Darius and Brooke have, by the way? I'm on 7 HP. Okay. 28. 28? Alright. Brooke's flowers have been burned. <laughs> okay, so. Guess what? Hmm. It's your guys' lucky day. Well, it's mostly Brooke's lucky day, so, um, oof. I'm not sure if I should use this or use something else, but damn. Actually. Yeah, fuck it. I haven't moved last turn, so. Feline agility. Over here. Cure wounds. Run back. <laughs> Is that the end of your turn? Let's see here. Anything I can do as a bonus action that doesn't require concentration because Darius still has Shield of Faith, so. Hmm. Not that's gonna be the end. First level, first level Q wound. Let's see. Alright, how many rounds has it been since the last time he did the fire attack where he breathes it? Uh, they've been two, haven't it? I apologize, I should have been keeping track of no, it. No, no, I think, no, it was three because it was we got put on fire, we got sent to the torture room, I put Darius out, the next round he got put back on fire. So, <laughs> um, three rounds. So is... Alright. Wait, Bowie, doesn't Bowie heal me? Yeah. Okay. Hey, Peach, want to know a neat trick that can help you um, keep track of the turns? You heal 9 yes. HP. Yes, please. Uh, under tur uh, the initiative tracker, you should see like a gear, I think, near the bottom. Yeah. Uh, you can make custom items there to add to the okay. initiative. Make one called like Fire Breath Counter and set it to zero. There's at the very bottom, there should be an option of like, I don't know what it's called, but there should be like a, like a bar where you can enter numbers in. Put plus one into it, then add it to the initiative. Put it underneath the um, the centaur. Uh, how? Click and oh, drag. I see. I see. If done correctly, it should increase by one every time you go over it, so you can keep track of how many turns it's been since you used fire breath. Okay. Okay. Cool. Darius's AC is still 21, correct? 19. No, it should be 19. 19. No? Oh, okay. With 17 plus 2. Okay, that's a hit. An unnatural 22. Well, actually, no, it's harder than that. I'm, I miscounted, but it's still a hit. That is 12 points of slashing damage. Ow. You can see that he's had quite enough of you being in his way, and he pulls his short sword out and slashes it across your chest. Um, he Wait makes... a second. 
I'm ten feet away. He has to move out of the dog's range to attack me. Yeah, you're right. He moved. <laughs> he moved. Well, he didn't move out of my range or into my range. No, but he did he move more than one more than one foot? That's the question. Yes. The roll damage slowly. Slashing. <laughs> <laughs> did you get recruited to the FBI after this, Lois? Because we control the battlefield. We really do. That is 20 damage. Holy shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Me and JT over here just like, Pete, uh, look at this battlefield I made, guys. You mean our battlefield. <laughs> he still Pete. seems unaffected. Pete is just going to get sick of me and, Jack, uh, me and JT constantly asking, did he move? Oh, you said get? I'm going to? As in, in the future? Wow. <laughs> you said get? That's one point off on every other role now because Professor Dickhead doesn't like the word get or got. True. It's not correct. Bad. Sorry, I had to be passive aggressive with that right now. <laughs> roll damage for the dog, or actually, now roll to hit for the wolf. Yay. And is that still an advantage? Yes, flanking? it's an advantage because okay. you're flanking. All right, just want to make sure of things. Sorry, you're fine. Eighteen. That is his AC. So go ahead and roll for damage. Oh. oh. Takes a nibble of his leg. You can also that he's really really injured um he's he's been bloodied for a while um he's covered in blood he's covered in wounds he's incredibly damaged right now and is showing no sign of pain ow i don't like that fact this guy's testosterone must be off the fucking roof I and, be and before this guy's a blood hunter or something <laughs> Don't get people. Should I say my theory? No. No. Save it. Okay. Save it. We will save it. Hey, let's do this again, JT. You're lucky. That's a miss. Are you going to do it, JT? Are you really going to do this, shoot me? Do what? Uh, I wasn't paying attention. Do you leave my well, reach or something? He's going to move. <laughs> Out of my reach. Yeah, sure is. All right, it's ass kicking time. Just no, it's not. Nah, darn. You escaped death once. I got twelve. Oh, I get to move. Oh my fucking god! Neat. But no, I think he also takes damage from brambles, doesn't he? Yeah, he does. Yeah, he does. It's like a once per turn thing. It's a constant. Yes, it is. Um, hang on, hang on. I just need something. Uh, where was he? He was right here. Forties. That is fifteen damage or slashing. Okay. As always, he appears to show no sign of pain. It is. Oh, hey, look, it's a one. That should be a two, though. No, it should be a three, because next turn, it'll be a four. I'm confusing myself. Well, anyway, it's it's the, it's the bird's turn. Wait, what? The, I said it's the bird's turn. Oh, okay. <gasps> McKinley! Oh my god! I know, it looks so... Freaking cool. Holy shit. I didn't take that long. <laughs> the fucking name for this is Lionel Fireman. <laughs> <laughs> Lionel Fireman. <laughs> Lionel nice. Fireman. Anyway. Um, anyway. Anyway. My intimidation is too low. So McKinley, I thank you for my new pro. It's a lot better than what I had in mind, which is just pure forge. 
Oh, He's look. going to use his plus... Well, actually, how far is he? Can I even make that shot? Yes? No. He, he's 40 I, feet from you. Am I able to make a shot that far with an arrow? Like, how can I... Look at your stats for the bow. 80. So, let's shoot with a plus one. It looks like he's fleeing and we should let him. <clears throat> 14, that's a miss. And then he's going to... Man, I really do be forgetting to do shit. Um... I need Booby and I need Booby Hoot. Actually, not fuck it. I'll just do it next time. It's fine. I felt that. Wait, what? Jess, no, what are you rolling action. for? Uh, that was my plus one bow, and then he's going to dash over. Here. Giddy click, not the measure. And then he is going to shoot it's from. Roll the hit. Seventeen. Miss. Still a mess. So yeah, he's not gonna be able to do anything for his turn. All right, Darius, it's your turn. Well, it left my range, so I guess I'll just kill myself because. Doesn't mean I get to mood. sentinel it. <laughs> Sad JT. Can I move to that spot right there yeah. that my um I'll I'm thirty six feet away and on an incline? Yeah, you're fine. Yeah, that's one. And he's still too far away to hit. Good. Guess I'll kill myself. No. Jump! Don't do that. I'm gonna rub myself and cast Cure Wounds at a second level slot. Do you have the love glove? Oh, I bring Bonnie knowledge and self care. <laughs> You're I so see. toxic. Also, you also run will make it, but you don't really use that. Is that going to be any of your turn? I don't know. I'm, run... I'm the one who has to loot the killer all match. You guys are the ones doing the gems. Why don't I bring we'll make it? <laughs> <laughs> At the end of your turn? Yeah. Let me roll healing before I die IRL. <laughs> <laughs> Stop choking. That's my job. Peach, get over here. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh. Oh, hey, look. The wolf took damage, and now he's at 2 HP. Wait, how much HP is the wolf at? 2. 2. Oh. Because he's still on fire. Oh, God. That's the end of my turn. Alright, it's the wolf's turn. I mean, it still lives, currently. I live, Currently. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, it's going to. That is my fuck, so it's. Eh. Eh. What is the dog? What is the wolf's movement speed? 40 foot. It's. Or 50. 40 to 50 die wolves have a really high movement speed. What is it? It's 50. It's 50, yeah. I can get there, actually. Yeah, you'd be in right in front of his face. Yeah, I uh, am speed. But is that a place you want to be? Too much um, left. Sacrifice. Yes, the dog isn't real. Trump I mean, it is. No, no, bizarre. You need to wake up. <laughs> the accident was ten years ago, Kit. <laughs> Look, he's gonna go away in an hour if I kept the concentration up. Anyway, I mean. All right, go ahead and roll the hit. Trump has a lane on more than she already is. Hold on, wait, let me check. Hold on, let me check. Hold on. Yeah, never mind. Okay. Who 
18. That is a hit. Go ahead and roll for damage. Thirteen. Thirteen. Roll twenty. You've been working so well for the past hour. Please, for the love of fucking God. Thank you. I'm not mad. You're mad. We're all mad. Is that gonna be the end we'll of right the doggo's turn? Okay. Yep, the doggo's. That's that's all. It's I can your do. turn. Um. Uh, the dog disappears. What? The dog disappears. I'm casting another concentration spell. And I am ca the concentration spell I am casting is Moonbeam at second level. Oh boy. Oof. That just put a damper in my plan, but go ahead. And so it begins, huh? And so it begins. <laughs> so it begins. So what am I doing? Do I roll? Do I roll save? Do you no. roll the hit? Uh, Moonbeam doesn't happen until next. Until it's, begins, yeah. You can cast it on huh? something. You so you can cast Moonbeam on someone, but we also I, we, me and JT also made this mistake because of how weird it's worded. You can, even if you cast Moonbeam on something, it doesn't have to make it doesn't have to make a save until its next turn. So nice. It makes a save on its turn, but it is yeah. now covered with Moonbeam. Alright, is that the end of your turn? Um, yeah, that's the end of my turn. Lois! Hello, I'm still on fire. I need to take fire damage. Oh yeah, you're right, you do. Burn that's me, daddy. One. Ow. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. not daddy, I'm mommy. Get it right. True. There's a and I'm gonna go I'm kill myself. On... Hey guys, guess what? I'm still on fire. <laughs> oh, yeah, but you're happy, Peach, because that, that means I can't do damage. Bowie, it's your turn! Yep. Yes, it is. Oh boy. Because Moonbeam's already on there, there's not much that I can do aside from ranged attacks, but there is something that I can do. Hmm. I'm checking party's health at the moment. I gotta refresh all the pages, dear lord, in order to actually update things. Okay. Alina's looking fine. Brooke's looking. Darius is looking fine as well. <laughs> <laughs> Brooke is looking fine. Darius is looking fine. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Kenneth hey. hasn't even been touched yet. Okay, so no one's low enough for me to actually start using the things, so might as well just focus on doing ranged attacks instead. So hmm. I can't rage yet. I can't do anything aside from just ranged attacks, so. Actually, wait, no, that wouldn't work. Fuck, god damn it. Oof. It also costs a lot of turns to prepare, so no, I'm not gonna do that. Just spiritual weapon time. The partisan that the partisan that was near um buoy is now just gonna fly towards the guy and start swiping. Does it have a movement speed? No, it's just it's just sixty foot range. No. Oh, okay. Just making sure. Yep. Does a 16 hit? No, it doesn't. No. It's a miss. Oh, shit. Bowie, Hoot, and Darius make a dex save. Dex? Oh, Fucking boy. fuck. Stop with the fire. <laughs> the ninth fire attack you've done this time. 25. <laughs> Listen, it's not... I mean, I was gonna say it's not my fault, but it is my fault. Ten. Twenty-one. At least you're not on fire. Still at twenty-three health. I'm gonna die. I'm on fire. Who <laughs> hey, 
who is on fire and you took six points of fire damage. And he's going to, well, actually, I'm going to save it as much as I want to use Hellish Tribuke. If you want to use it, do it, because he's no. low on health. You might not get a chance to do it. I know, but I also need, I want to save Cure Wounds. It's a Boo, we have well, fine. We can heal ourselves. Okay. Fine. Um, if you if you're worried, sorry. Go ahead. If you're worried about healing, I still have most of my spell slots left. So yay. Same here. So uh, yeah, Kenneth is okay. gonna use his. Okay. So now that I can talk, when you get hit and you have a reaction to do something, that reaction does not take up a spell slot. No, I think it does because it's you still cast. Mine does. Spell. Let me double check though. It's under a first level spell, and I, when I press yes, cast, it puts I'm, a pack. I know, but if it's a reaction, I don't think it does. Let me check. No, it does. It's yeah. a no, reaction it does, spell. Then I would, my, I would yeah. have been doing pockets and wrong. Okay, then I am wrong. Go ahead and roll to. What is it? Do you roll to hit? Do I roll a save? Uh, it's a dex save of 14, but. Uh, it takes half damage even if you make it. Why? Uh, uh, da, da, da. the creature the must make is. a dex. Yeah, must make a dexterity s saving throw. It takes two D damage, fire damage on a failed save, or half as much damage on a successful one. Okay. So it's taking damage regardless. Eh, yes. I'm not sure that's true, guys. Yeah, uh, you're sorry. Wrong. Yeah, um, he, he I neglected to mention. He... I neglected to mention that I I saw two things with Hunter's sense and only saw fit to bring up one because I didn't figure it'd come up. Sorry. Yeah, he's resistant to fire. Resistant or immune? Resistant. So and one he passed, <laughs> he passed his check. I rolled a twelve. He has a modifier of two, so he passes it, and then he yeah. has resistance to it. So he resistance... takes half of half. Yeah. Wonderful. Okay. Sorry. It's still damage. Yeah, damage is damage. damage. Oh my uh, god. I swear to god, when I see you again in January, I'm punching you in the face. What the fuck did I do this time? I love you. What the fuck did I do? I love you, but calm down. <laughs> I'm so confused. You're getting worked up about it, and it's fine. It's okay. So half of a half. You can't see me, but I'm patting your head. <laughs> One point seven. Okay. So One point seven five, but we round up, so it's two damage. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm Asian. I have a calculator on me at all times. <laughs> it's like it's like Mara right there. Careful, so it takes see. two damage. How much? Two. Yeah. Oh my fucking god. And I forgot god, to say, 20. forgot to say, he points at him and says, motherfucker. Yeah. Give me a second. I don't think his turn's over yet. As much as I'm sure all of you want it to be. He's gonna move again, is he? What? Like a fucking pansy. This discriminatory I mean, practice against people with lower movement speeds. Yeah, I know, right? Lois, go ahead and roll your damage for your brambles. Okay, give me a second. Um, thank you. Oh, wait, that's a tar sort of just turn there. Doesn't that mean he would take moonbeam damage as well? Oh, then his turn. Oh, it's is it the end. Answer to turn? Is it the end or is it the beginning? What does it say in the spell? It's not over yet. It's okay. What is it? Oh, God damn it. If it's on the spell, yeah, if it starts its turn there. Oh, okay. Also so, damage. roll your moonbeam damage. Um, he also has to make a con save of 16. <sighs> okay, give me a second. I miss my bed because it's so big and I don't have to be afraid of rolling off in the middle of the night. But at the same time, it's really hard. So, when I sit in a certain way without, um, without support under my hips, I have really bad pain in my hips and lower back. 
Peach, you say that as if you weren't the one who put your bed in the center of the room. I like my bed in the center of the room, though. But if and you I don't fall, move. That's your own fault. And I don't move when I sleep. I stay in one one spot. One uh, con safe. What's the DC kit? Sixteen. 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 That is a. That is a sixteen. Okay, it still takes half of that, which is seven damage. Okay. Seven? Yep. Lois, did you roll your damage? Uh, yeah, I rolled a 13. Flashing. 13? Yes. Okay. Just so you guys know, he looks heavily damaged. Still showing no sign of pain. I love that even when I'm on fire and I can't do anything like like look like actually as Alina, I'm still doing damage on the side because of the brambles. <laughs> you could <can> never escape. <laughs> All right, it's now Kit. Uh, not Kit. Kenneth's turn. Um, he's going to shoot his one bow as kind of a like a shot that's saying. Just get the fuck away from us. You guys came onto his turf. I know. And All we were doing is walking. We were walking. 16, so he's going to miss that. You missed. And then, yeah. And then, I'm going to dash over. I guess here, because why not? And then, bolts from the grave. Um, you're trying to use bolts from the grave. Darius is right in front of you. Don't... I'm not taking up that entire five foot square. Yeah. Yeah. Hang on, let me like let, let, let me get an image there. for a second. There you go. Take like a look oh, at that. Nice. Hey, double damage. Go and ahead and roll for damage. Is and that's my heavy hitter. I need to get off of spells first. 3d6 plus 4. Who dares? 18 times 2. Calculator, it's your turn. 18 times 2? Yes. 36. 36 points of damage. Okay, give me a second. Necrotic damage. Necrotic? Oh shit, this yes. is not isn't it? No, he's not. Shouldn't be. I'd be very no, alarmed if it was. He gets hurt. He's still alive, but he gets hurt. And so all he's going to shout after that is, just get the fuck away and spare your own life. Do you say this in turn? What do you say this in common? Uh, I mean, there's a very high possibility that it sounds like it could be out of mimic. I don't know, but yeah, he says it in common, but he's just banking on the dude possibly knowing that this might be some common that he heard. Well, something he heard mimicked in a group of. Literally, he's in a group of fighters right now, so there's a very high chance that he heard it from somebody. He looks at you. Did I have to roll for wisdom? You can tell that he understands exactly what you just said to him. He makes no point to run or any point to respond to what you said. Also, yes, roll me wisdom. That one. I'm, I'm going to scream. I had a nat fucking 20, and the very next one is a nat fucking 1. Welcome to my world on um, Wednesday. Go to the torture room. Okay. <laughs> okay, chat, let's see what fucking shit I got into this time. 
Oh, I just realized Peach changed her icon. Yeah. Okay. What terrifying hell life do I see now? Zahor is not there. You see complete black once again. Zahor is not there. You see the eyes just like before. Except you don't hear a voice this time. Well, at first you don't hear a voice. And then you do. It's like it's slowly fading in. Like someone was talking to you, but you just couldn't hear it. Just be quiet. And then their voice starts to get louder. Um, you don't hear any specific words. It's many different voices all speaking at one time. And you can't concentrate on any one specific voice. Okay. Um, Lois, I have a question. Yes? How does the fear, um, condition? Is that, is that a condition? Two seconds. I think it's frightened, but let me just double check. Because fear is a spell, while frightened... No, I'm, I, meant, I meant frightened. Okay, frightened. Um, a frightened creature has disadvantage on ability, tech and ability checks and attack rolls. Or the source of its fear is within line of sight. The creature cannot willingly move closer towards the source of fear. Pretty much what that means is okay. if Kenneth tries to do, if, if I guess it's Kenneth who's going to get the uh, thing, you, you, a disadvantage to attack mm -hmm. and ability checks. So ability checks things like, um, you know, uh, well, I think they'll think like nature, medicine, shit like that, uh, I think. Mm -hmm. I believe. I mean, I'll have to double check myself, but I'm a dumbass. Um, and pretty much, uh, well, as long as you are in the line of sight of the fear, so even if the thing's not looking at you, um, as long as, as long as, if, if, if the thing's not looking at you, as long as you're looking at it, you have the frightened condition until it ends, and you cannot willingly move any closer towards the silver bridge, unless if you have, like, a spell casting, like, like, command or dominate person, you willingly will not be able to move closer towards this, you will only want, you know, so where you are now, you cannot move any closer. I'll go back to the mute room now. Okay. So yeah, what she just explained to you is what's going to happen now. You hear, you hear this cacophony of voices, and you just feel nothing but pure terror go course through your body. Okay, I have a few questions. Hmm. First one is going to be related to what he's hearing. Does it sound anything like the fireplace he once saw no. that he was threatened with? Okay. And then second is, so is he frozen in place, or can he only move away? He can move, you just cannot willingly move closer to the centaur anymore. Okay. So that is all I had. Alright, bye-bye! Hey. Can't hear Peach. I'm not talking. Oh, okay. Your thing, like, lit up green for, like, a bit, and then it's just, like, nothing came out. Yeah. What is that circle, Jake? You told me to kill who? I'm taking careful aim. What? <laughs> <laughs> Pulling shots, aiming dots. Yeah, I don't miss. That's funny. If yeah. anyone can tell me what song that's from, you're an epic gamer. You calling in cluster strike Darius. It is Darius's turn. Take him out, boys. His AC is mean. Uh, though it pains me to do it, I'm gonna have to take the dash action. Let me do some measuring real quick. You have 35 movement speed, JT. 70 dashing is great. Oh, yeah. I need, an extra, I need an extra 10 to get close to him. That should put me within 10 feet of him. So, right in the danger zone. Hey. So, 
but he's also in uh, bad straits right now. So it's all it's all all fair in war. That'll be the end of my turn. All right, Kit, your turn. Sorry, what? I'm also mom. Your turn. It's your turn. It's my turn. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm going to move Moonbeam back onto Ooh. it. Because it was like right here ish, and it's. Yeah, that's it's Moonbeam's back on it. Okay. And then let me check really quick of something. Is that an action to do or a bonus action? Uh, I'm checking right now, actually. It's a bonus action if I remember. No, that's Moving an action. It's an action. It's an action, really? That is a full Moonbeam's action. a powerful spell. Huh. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, and it's also been buffed because of Calamus, so. Oh, yeah. okay. Um, I will say I'm going to move. Um, here, let's. Eh, like. Yeah, like right here. Um, just in case if I have to move it again, I'm still in range of it because. So yeah. And that's gonna be my turn. Alina's turn. I'm still on fire. She's still on fire. So roll fire damage. Tell me how how much I burn for. Six. All right. You know what? You know what? It's tempting to it's tempting to try and put myself out right now, but like, you know what? I'm gonna attack twice instead. Roll to hit. Because I got I got I, I can heal myself so. That is a uh, 18, 19, 20. That's a 21. And then a 22, 23. That's a 25. So 21, 24, 21 and 25. They both hit. Roll uh, for a tablet. 2d8 plus. And I believe Grasping Arrows actually... Has it, been, has it been 10 rounds, guys? Has it been 10 rounds? I think it has, hasn't it? Yeah. So I'm not sure. Yes. Yeah. Thanks, yes, so. it has. So Grasping Arrows ended now. And I'm casting it again because. <laughs> so... Lois, no, Lois, look at me. Yes. Don't. There's no point. Don't. There's no point. Don't do it. Okay. Um, let's see. Come on, damage. I'm gonna do it again. That is that is max damage. That is 32 damage. That is max damage. Nice. I feel like he's dead. We'll see. And then... if not, he's like one more Elena shot. What really? Oh, just one, and then I'm gonna just uh, bonus action second wind just to get back the HP that I lost from being on fire. Lois, yes. How do you want to kill him? Oh, for fuck! <laughs> this is the third. This is the third boss I've killed in a row. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. This I'm... is not fair. <laughs> oh, so I'll get back eleven HP, but let me just get that back to myself. Give me back the HP. Give me a second. Oh shit! I, oh, that's like forty-eight HP. Nice. Um. Oh god, I'm too far away to. God, I, I, I was like, okay, if I'm close, I'm really close to how I'm gonna kill him. Now I'm like, oh wait, shit, I'm really far away. I can't do this. Never mind. <laughs> I'm too far away to do this. Uh, oh fuck, headphones, get off. Um. Well, let's see. He's a giant flaming horse guy. So, hmm. What would be a good place? You know what? So, seeing the fact that it's a big old fucking horse, gonna shoot him. Uh, Lena's gonna like draw back her bow, kind of like obviously on fire, but just like you know what, this has to end. <laughs> this has to end now, and then she could put herself out without being under stress of you know, the the horse fucker. Um, so she's gonna draw back her bow, shoot right towards the again a, a classic shot of crippling it by the knee. And the second mm-hmm. it tries to take, uh, the second it's like gonna like be face towards her or something, she's gonna shoot it dead in the eye. Ooh. All right. Give me a second. And then just be like, okay, gonna go put myself out now. And she's gonna be like, can I just should I pat myself down to put myself out now? Mm-hmm. Let's see. Come on. Come on. Come on. And then she fails. Yeah. That's a twenty-seven. <laughs> nice. Yay! Give me one momento. Eh. 
hey guys, we just killed something that was in its own territory that we crossed over. Yay! Okay. You it attacked, attacked us first. first. I don't see what the big reservation is here about this are. It attacked us first. We were defending right. ourselves. I mean, yeah, we were defending All we started ourselves. doing was walking, and then it started like, it just saw me crouch behind a rock and started shooting at me. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah, it's called run away from it. chicken. I had a pretty fun run away plan, not gonna lie. <laughs> Oh well, I'll use it another day. Cause it's still fun. Aw, oh, you son of a bitch. What? It won't play a song that's longer than three hours. Nice. Fuck you. Fine, I'll do without the ambient effect, you son of a bitch. It's so that rhythm bot doesn't, you know, kill itself. Well, what if I wanted to kill itself? Alright, I have something for you guys. Lois. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Here's a second. Uh. All right. Alina deals the final blow to this beast of a creature. You're not sure if it's a man or what the fuck it is. As you shoot it these last two times, for the first time since you fought this thing, it shows pain. It lets out this heart wrenching roar of pain. You hear what sounds to be a normal male voice, like someone, like a man that you would talk to. You hear his voice yelling in pain, combined with the sound of uh, some feline roaring as well. The creature's red eyes glow brightly for a moment, and they turn completely red. There's no more blacks of his eyes. It's just all pure red, and blood begins to just cascade down his face from his eyes. You see black spots begin to appear all around his body and all of you shouldn't just smell especially Darius since he's right there on top of it. You all smell the smell of a rotting corpse that's been laying out in the sun. You watch as this creature's cries of pain slowly come to a stop. Alina's arrow that he shot into his knee makes him begin to fall to the ground. But by the time his body touches the ground, he's nothing but a rotten corpse. As his body lays on the ground, the spots continue to spread over his body. He's, he's dead already. He's already dead. These spots, these rotting spots continue to spread all over the body until finally all you see is just bones. And then all of you hear a very loud crack as these bones begin to splinter and break of their own accord. And then watch as they all turn to dust and disappear in the wind. Attack of the body snatchers. Ooh. Brooke whispers uh, underneath her breath. What the hell? Kenneth's just staring in fear, not knowing what the fuck to do. Well, that was fucked. Necromancy is afoot, possibly. Definitely. Anyways, everyone all right? I'm putting his on fire. Yep. Fine. Completely fine. Also, I'm gonna ask a stupid question. How much fire points? How many? How many points of damage did I take earlier? Because I never got to hear the number. Wasn't it like seventeen? Think yes. so. I would like to find my hat. Oh my god, oh, yeah. the poor hat. That's easy to find. How, how singed is it? It's just, it's fine. G give it to me straight, doctor. Is it okay? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, it's cinched a little bit, but it's fine. You can Quick, do any of us have mending? Let me check. Booyah. You do. God, fucker. My goddamn hat. <laughs> Hey, you need help with that? Really, D and D Beyond, you're not gonna. Uh, no, no, we both keep moving. Seriously? I'm not gonna bring my head in battle with this fire. Okay, cool. It's finally loaded. Also, when this body rotted away, it left behind the spear, a short sword, and a longbow. 
We could probably sell it. <laughs> I'm gonna go over and take. I'm gonna carefully touch the arms and make sure. And like. <laughs> make sure they aren't cursed. I'm just gonna touch it real quick and then stop touching it. Quick little poke. Brooke, don't touch the weird items that the weird undead hey. feline centaur guy had. I. It's too late. God damn, I knew I was going to do something. I was hoping. You should do something bad when she. Okay, Peach has this signature hay. When you sh when she says that hay, you know something bad's going to happen. Oh no, guess who's the new owner of a new pet snake? <laughs> it's going to be Brooke, is it? I need you to roll a wisdom save. You know what? I can do that. Famous Most last of the word. time. Famous last words right there, kid. Oh, I can, I can do that. Roll the that one. Peach, would you kindly dispel the initiative tracker? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> I, I have a plus nine to wiz and I got a nat fucking- I need Lois and Kit to meet me in my torture room. Hey. Uh, Jesus. Yeah, she owns a pet snake! Yay! Are you kidding me? <laughs> One day you'll stop. I- What? It's not my fault. Mm. I'm playing. You're fine. I know you're. I'm. I'm fucking with you, kid. It's okay. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, it's 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 fine. Are you ready? Yeah. You touch. Well, which which weapon was it that you touched? Oh, which weapons were there? There was a spear, a short sword, and a longbow. I touch the short, short sword. Okay. You touch the short sword, and even as quick as a touch as it was, your vision goes completely black. And you see a pair of red eyes, the no. same as the centaurs. No. And you hear a woman talking to you. No. What? Her no. voice is very calming, but also deeply terrifying. These eyes seem to look straight into you and at your soul. These eyes feel cold. Very, very cold and old. At first, you don't hear anything. All you're doing is staring at these eyes. You can't look anywhere else. You feel as if you if you look away, something awful will happen. When you finally hear a voice, you just begin to shake. Your body begins to shake as this voice just spreads nothing but fear through you. What does she say? There is more. For a moment, that's all the voice says. There is more. And then you hear laughter. You think this was tough. Just wait until you meet the others. You hear more laughter. The longer this laughter continues, the more maniacal and insane it begins to sound, and it's all you can hear. The laughter it fills your head, and your body begins to shake even more. You see a face suddenly appear before you. The eyes are gone. The eyes disappear completely, and then a moment later, a face appears before you. And give me a second, and I'll give you a picture. Here, I'll DM you the picture, because I don't want the others to see. Alright. You just see the face. Actually, no, you see the whole body. This is what you see. Once it looks. 
Mm, that's not creepy at all. Well, I'll DM you the same picture. You see this woman appear before you. The empty sockets have glowing red embers that maybe were her eyes. Maybe they are just embers. You're not entirely sure. Seeing these eyes, you feel just cold cascade down your body. You feel awful. You feel like your body is frozen. And all you hear is her laughter. I try as calmly as possible, but there's still a quiver in my voice of, Who are you? You see her mouth stretch into a grin. Why would I tell you that? Don't worry. We'll meet again. And then she disappears completely from your view, and you can actually see now. Your vision is no longer black. <sighs> Meet me back over there. Yeah, that's okay. Um, so hold on, hold on, Kit. You all see uh, Brooke walk over and she goes to either touch the short sword or pick it up, inspect it, or something. Her fingers brush against it and she goes completely still. Darius, you are right there. You can see exactly what's going on. The others don't have a really good field of view, especially since you guys are up on an incline. Um... You can see just her face goes blank, like, almost like she's asleep. And then you see her face scrunch up and just pure fear. Her body begins to shake. She has a cold sweat on her. Like, you can see her sweating. You're close enough to touch her, honestly. She feels freezing to you, like a dead body. You hear her ask, who are you? And she seems to shake more. And then you can tell her eyes, they look clouded over. And then a moment later, that cloudiness is gone, and she's back. The second I laugh, I start nervously laughing. <laughs> Good news is I don't think I'm cursed. Bad news. Yeah, it's just going out. You guys can't bad hear news her. is Oh, okay. Bad news um bad news just serious. Um bad news There's a very scary lady. Yeah, no shit. Uh, not there. Sorry. Did you see her too? <laughs> Yeah, earlier. It's not important. If you don't mind me asking, why are you trying to pick up the sword that we don't need? The obviously cursed enemy that we just killed, and it rotted away into nothing. I was gonna try and examine it. I accidentally touched it, and that was that. Yeah, well... Don't go examining things in the future. We've gone fucked over enough. Just be careful. Next time I'll not be so forgiving. Let's get back to the others. Do you feel sick? No. Darius nods and slides down the incline, making his way back to the party. Hmm. Brooke takes off her sash and she's gonna make sure her hand is completely covered and she's gonna pick it up. Okay. 
Nothing happens? No. Alright. I'm taking it with me. Why? I'm exam- I'm gonna examine it. No, oh, gee. Can we see her holding it before she comes down? Oh, yeah. Um, I'm, like, very gingerly holding this to make sure, like, no, like, like, I've even buttoned up my shirt. Like, no un, like, covered part of my body is touching this thing. Brooke, why are you carrying that around? Because I'm curious. Not as bad not to be curious with things like that. Did you not see what just happened to it? I'm very... I saw exactly what happened. And I'm curious as to why. I'll also say something with those eyes. I don't know about anyone else, but... At one point my vision went black and I heard a voice. I was just about to ask you about that. Cause so we all met the scary lady? I, I also saw the war there. Oh, I but I didn't, she wasn't scary to me. I heard screams of help. No, yeah. you didn't. But I... I said. No. Okay. Anyway. anyway. Uh, she's asking. They like cross her arms, like... Kind of like, just gonna like look to like, the side, just like... I... I pretty much heard her just... She asked to come find... She asked me to come find her. So, she gave me no directions on where... Who, who she was or where she was. And I'm not the one for following ghosts. <laughs> She said to me that there is more, and that, I'm quoting her, um, verbatim, I guess, uh, said something about us thinking it was tough, which, yeah, that was really difficult, but she told me to wait until we meet the others. So, there's more out there like that, then? Yeah, that's why I'm taking this thing to... See if there's anything I can figure out about it. All I know is I saw Zoom, so I'm going to try to get back in touch with him, because out of everything else, sadly, somehow, I trust him more than whoever this lady is. Well, and at least he makes his... Go on, bro. At least we know who he is. I mean, yeah, it's not a good idea to trust him, but... Can't sway your opinion. I mean, my life's already intertwined with his, so I pretty much have no other way to do it, so I'll take take my chances and just go with it. Just Kenneth, don't be suicidal. I'm not trying to. Honestly, it, he is my only lifeline to somehow maybe to the afterlife. But at this point, if I end up in the fire, I end up in the fire. At least I need to keep on a good side of him, instead of fucking it over like I'm with everybody else. Even if you say that, don't go throwing yourself into battle if you can't take it. The last thing we want, the last thing we want to deal with you is dying. The last thing any of us want to see is you dying. Last life or not, I don't want to. I'm trying to see at least, I at least want to get in contact with him, because if he was there while she, I, I heard her, there's some type of connection, and I need to Again, if you get nothing, hmm. if you get nothing, let's not go chasing ghosts unless we get more information. Exactly. We should probably get a move on. Yes. I want to get out of here. Anyways, if you... Sorry. It's okay. Book, if you if you want to examine that, put it in a, put it in one of my spare blankets so that no one can touch it, and make sure that it's tied up with something so that it doesn't fall out. Right. I can cast I can cast detect magic on it later. Yeah. My thought is, should we? No, probably this one's good enough. I just we probably shouldn't try our luck with the others. Please don't. And yeah. Brooke, if it goes missing, I'm putting the blame on you first. Okay. 
because it's carrying around possible cursed magical swords that belong to something undead with glowing red eyes isn't something I'm particularly fond of. Hmm. Well, Bowie's just gonna, you know, pat, pat Kenneth on the shoulder and say he did good this time, and she's also gonna turn towards Alina and just say, hey, I'm pretty sure we'd be dead without you at this point, <laughs> and then just start leaving towards the cart before turning towards Darius and just saying, uh, hey, I kind of need some help with the cart and stuff, so oof. And just signals Darius to just come over, I guess. Could this involve lifting? Maybe. <laughs> All right, guys, that's where we're going to end the session. Hey. hey. Dun, dun, dun. You guys gained a level up. Oh, shit. Oh, yes. oh shit. Oh, shit. Shots. Arcane shots. Arcane shots. <laughs> Guys? Some random ass thing I need to think of. Some random ass thing I need to think of. We'll do that later. I think I get Slayer's Prey upgrade. Ooh. Well, that's all I say is please stay after because I need to. I'll try. No, no. I'll stay as well. I can stay. We'll even try and drag Espeon into this since he's the warlock person. Hmm, do I want AoE or do I want a blind? How about neither? <laughs> that seems like a good idea. Uh, you know, hey let's, guys, let's go Shadow Arrow. Let's go I this. have key points now. Oh no. <laughs> What's the key point? Um, monk shit. It's how I get to do funky stuff as a monk. Also, I have a 40 foot walking speed, fear me. <laughs> <laughs> Monks. I was gonna go into rogue, but I think I, th I thought about. It. I thought no, I'm gonna go one more level into arcane archer before going into rogue, so I get more arcane shots. More arcane Good idea. shots. More arcane shots. Arcane <laughs> shots. Arcane hey Peach, shots. you like grasping arcane arrow? Shots. No, grasping arrow three times. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> to the sh to the Feywild Jimbo. To the Feywild Jimbo. I'm gonna get mundane healer. No, don't. That's a spell I need to fix. No, it's so dare. fucking broken. <laughs> JT, no, don't do it. What do I want to go into rogue? Actually, do I want to go into rogue now? No, no, no. I, 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 want, I want a few more hit points. Never mind. I want more hit points and more arcane shots. Oh yeah, I also get magic arrow now and curving shot, which, is, which means any arrow I can make is now magical, which overcomes magical resistance of any kind. And I also got curving shot, which means if I miss... I can then redirect the arrow to hit another target. <laughs> Pretty much, it's just like, oh, I miss, or do I? <laughs> oh, I miss, or do I? But anyway, chat, thanks for watching this chaotic mess. No, thanks wait, since I have key points now, it's just prepare for trouble.